What did he do? Yes. Is that what you're asking? I should be asking what have you done? You met a process. You met a procedure. This is a disciplinary process. And your father is here, the way supervising it and you 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 threw yourself into it and stopped it. Father, not this way. Not this way. Please, Father. Hey, you Claudia. Oh Father, stop! What is wrong with you both? How can you be hitting your fellow man? So you stop! Hit him! Hit him! Stop! Stop! What is wrong with you, princess? So, so, you are countering my order. You no, are countering my order. My order, you are countering. You are countering. Please, Father, forgive him. You know Udoka is an obedient servant. Do not send him away like that. Please. Quiet, princess. Do you know what is going to cost me to repair that car he damaged? Why must he run my car into a gutter simply because he's trying to avoid a speeding truck? Didn't he know what to do? What to drive? How to avoid it? He should have known better. Should have driven better. Should have avoided it. Princess. I think you should allow your father to be for now. As you can see, he's very angry. Of course. Maybe by tomorrow, he might change his mind. But first and first, let Odoka leave. Mom. Mom, why are you talking like this? Instead of you to talk to your husband, to pity him and accept him back, you are asking Odoka to go. No, this is really unfair. Unfair? Yes. Now what did I say wrong? What? Did you not hear when your father said he should go? And that's exactly what I think. I think he should go. Hold it, princess. Like I said earlier, allow your father to be. He might change his mind tomorrow. Maybe after fixing the car, this young man is spoiled. So for now, I think you should leave. I am disappointed at you. It's okay, Ma. It's okay. I will leave. Thank you, my princess. But, Your Majesty, remember you, you've not paid my, my four months salary. Please, can you pay me now so that I'll, I'll be able to take care of myself and my poor mother? Now take a look at the person you're pleading on his behalf. He's acting as if he has no remorse for what he spoiled. Acting as if he did not spoil that car. But he's right, Mom. He's right. Would you pay him his four months salary? Huh? What did you say? Now get out of here before you end up in the police station. Get out! Imagine what? She's your daughter. Your daughter. She is our daughter. Your daughter. Your own daughter. Yours. Yours. Please wait, okay? Wait here for me. I'll be back. Just wait. Come on, please.
I'm sorry for what happened. Okay? This is not the end of the world. This is the right time for you to look for something you can do to be useful to yourself. Hmm? Because this palace guard will not take you anywhere. This is 300,000 naira. Start with it. No matter how small. 300,000. Thank you. Thank you so much. You don't know what you've done for me and my poor mother. Thank you so much. And I, I, I promise you, I'll use this money wisely, and I'll and I'll make you proud. Thank you so much. That is what I'm expecting from you. Use the money wisely. Thank you. Go well. God bless you. Off to the shop. Okay. Okay. That is good. Uh, Chuma, okay. come. Bring one seat there. I want to talk to you. Uncle, I hope all is well. No, just bring one seat. I want to talk to you. Uh, but Uncle, I'm late for work. Oh. Um, Chuma, Uncle. you are my elder brother's son, mm. which makes you to be like a son to me. It is my responsibility to always instruct you on the right things to do. It doesn't matter how I say it, whether harsh, whether smooth, what matters is I tell you the truth. In this whole community, all your mates are all married, doing good businesses, building houses. And in your case, what are you doing? What are your plans? Is that how you are going to stay? Uncle, I've heard all you said. According to you, I don't have a lucrative business. I don't own a house of my own. I'm not even married. But uncle, I'll tell you one thing. I'll keep managing the little business I have so I can take care of my mother. I'll build a house when the time comes. Speaking about a wife, God will provide one for me. When will that be? Chuma. You see this house I managed to build. Very soon, by December of this year, I will be coming home with my family. How are we going to manage this house? And let me tell you, before you even think of getting married, you have to build a house. Because this little house cannot accommodate your wife and my family. All of us. I'm not going to accommodate us. So you, so you need to sit up and be a man. Do what your mates are doing. Uncle, I've heard everything you said. Thank you. I'm off to work. I've heard your uncle Ihejika talking to you in the morning. You have to consider what he said. 
give it a second thought. Eh? After all, you are not getting any younger. Even if it is one month, one drop. Before you know it, you will finish the house. Eh? Time waits for no man. Please. And again, then you put your marriage the second agenda. Mama, you don't understand. <laughs> My uncle was indirectly asking me to leave this house. Huh? That he intends bringing back his family. And when he does, the house will be too small for us. Mama, I don't understand. Hmm. I should be the one asking him to leave this house because this house rightfully belongs to me. My father told me he built this house. So I should be the one asking him to leave. My son, please calm down. Calm down. Please. Don't go there. Eh? Eh? You know who your uncle is. He is a bad man. Please. Remember what your late father told you. Yeah. He said no matter what, you should avoid making trouble with him. Avoid him. Please. Okay? Hey. Please. Oh. Um, I have heard you. But I won't let him disrespect or humiliate me like that again. Be calm. Maganda, be calm. Be calm. Be calm. He's a bad man. Oh. Don't forget that. Hmm. My son. Mm -hmm. <laughs> My son, you say you wanted to tell me something. Yeah. Yes. Mm -hmm. Mama. Mm -hmm. I I want to tell you hmm, mm -hmm. that I'll be traveling to the city. Mm -hmm. uh, to know if I I can start up something with this money the princess gave to me. Mm. Yeah, something like, you know, a little business. Yeah, because I, I promise her that I uh, I am going to use the money wisely. Yeah. But at a time now I will start putting my hands inside, spending the money and man working a garden. Yes. But sorry, if I may ask you. Yeah? What type of business do you want to do with that money? <laughs> and again, when you travel to the city, where are you going to be sleeping? Because uh, you don't have anybody. I don't want no mad on a city. Mama. Hi. Mama. Mm -hmm. Udoka, your son, huh? is no longer a boy. Mm. I'm a man now. And whatever comes to a man yeah, is equal to that man. Mama, don't worry. When I get to the city, yeah, I'll know what to do. Mm. Yeah. Mama, I'm worried though. Are you going out to have four blues on Mama? Yes, but at the same time, I'm worried. I don't want anything to happen to my son. I know. So, I know. Yeah? Mama? Mm? One thing you have to do for me hmm, is to minimize the way you go to the farm. Huh? My son. Mama, promise me you will stop going to the farm in the morning and coming back in the evening. I don't like it. Yeah. I can promise. I can have a farm. My son, you know, is this farm is what that kept us alive in this village. Mama, look. I will Papa. not promise anything. No, man, I got a farm. Papa died a long time ago. I know, I know, and I know how, how things are for us. Mama, if I, if I lose you, I'm not going to lose you. I'm not going to lose you. If I lose you, nobody is going to die. Oh? Mama, be cool. But I'm promising you that I will cut the way I'm going. I'll cut that. Mama, hmm? I'm, I'm going to the city because of you and I. I know. I won't be going. I'll wipe these tears from your eyes. Amen. I promise. Amen. Amen. I promise. Amen. And God will bless you. Amen. Even in this business, you will sell over Amen. there. Amen. You will make it. Nobody will cut your glory short. In the name of Jesus. Shall be well with you, Mom. Okay, let me. I'm doing something inside before I. Mamudo. Eh, Mamu. What to to Mamu? Eh, Nyungwa. Okay, Mamu. Uh, that one, that one, they okay. I want the one that is very strong. 
this one is this one is strong. The difference is the price. If you take the difference is just the price. How much is this one? This one? Yes. This one is six fifty. No, I don't like this one. I want a very strong. Uh, very take strong. that one now. Take that one. Because good. They collect expensive. I need the key that can lock that once I lock my shop, I don't need all these things to come out. Uh, that this one is very soft. Oh can work. You will take strong. this one. But it's just the difference is just the price. I don't like this one. Oh, I want a very strong key. And take that one now. What of this one? Let me see. And this one, the gold key. The difference is just the price, like I told you. How much is this one? This one now is one five. Eee! It's just one this five. It's expensive. Let's forget about this. This How one is, is this one, one 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 one. It's expensive now, guys. No, now you know the economy right now. Which is expensive? You want me to buy key from you? Ha! The other piece is the same. No, key. you are my first customer. <laughs> if you don't buy, who will buy it? Please buy. This is one one. But we'll take 1000. I'll give you 900. No, now, Auntie. Let me go oh, else. Wait. wait. Huh. 900 is good now. It's fine. Yeah, key. Okay, say 900. I'm in a hurry. Auntie. No, calm down now. I'm going to. 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 I'm I don't sell fake. I don't sell. I don't sell. Thank you. Thank you. The aqua shop get back. Beauty, beauty, beauty saloon. You know, that city in a nylon. Thank you. Since morning, is this how a man should live? I don't even have enough money to stock up my shop. I don't have enough goods in the store. I hardly see customers. Ah! God, I just hope you see all this. I just hope. I sleep one day and never wake up. What kind of life is this? How am I supposed to take care of my sister and my mother as the first son in the family? This is a complete shame. Ah! I can't continue like this. If I continue like this, one day, I will not pray to wake up. I will just pray to you to take my life from sleep. What is this? I do not want to lose my mother. My father died because there was no money. And now this is my mom. God, please. Only you can heal her. Please have mercy. Have mercy on my mother. I don't want her to die. I don't want to become an orphan. Mas, good day. Tina, not someone to see you at his office. Why? What happened? What's the problem? Nothing really. I just want to see you at his office. Like right now? Yes, right now. Nurse, please. You know you can always talk to me. Is anything wrong? Is my mother getting worse? Tell me, I can handle it. Why does he want to what does he want to tell me? Eh? Nothing really. Just go and see him at his office right now. Excuse me.
Good day, doctor. Yeah, good day. Uh, uh, doctor, the nurse said you you want to see him. Yes, you can see that. Okay, sir. Yeah, well... The reason I asked to see you is to tell you the health condition of your mother. How is your brother? Uh, my brother is still at the store. Well... And, uh, how is my mother? Well, it's okay. We've done a series of tests on her. Okay. And the situation right now, we have to carry out five broad and appendix operation on her. Yes. But before that, you have to make a deposit of 250000 before we can do anything on her. Doctor, doctor, wait, wait, wait. Let me be sure I heard you clearly. Did you say 250,000 Naira? Yes. Like 250,000? Yes. Deposits? Yeah, of course. <laughs> doctor, we cannot afford it. There is nowhere on this planet Earth we can get this money. Home and abroad. We cannot afford it all. We don't have money. There's nobody. We don't have relatives that can even give us the money. And doctor, please, I know there's something you can do. Please just use your good office. I know you're a good man. Mm? Please, please, please. I do not want to lose my mother. Mm? And I'm begging you. Just do whatever you can to save the life of my mother. I am begging. Eh, please. Well, eh? there is nothing I can do. Absolutely nothing I can do about this. You have just two days. Two days to provide this money. You have to do it fast before your mother's condition will get worse. Doctor, doctor, just calm down. Eh? Please, I need to calm down. Eh? down. Let's reason together. See, doctor, I promise you, see this money, I'm going to pay you. What I need you to do right now is just to commence treatment on my mother. Just start. Eh? Do the operation. Okay? I, I will go and run round. I, I will go I will run it round and I will bring this money to you. It is a promise. If you do this for me, I promise I will never disappoint you. I'll bring this money to you, do, do, doctor. Please, I'm begging you. Well, eh? we don't make promises in the hospital. Hmm? You have to go and look for the money. There's no time. Doctor. Earlier the better. Doctor, two hundred and fifty thousand is like two hundred and fifty million. Doctor, are you sure there's nothing you can do? Doctor, please now. Doctor, I'm begging you. Just help me. I'll save my mother's life first. I mean, I promise you. I, I, I know that some people will say this. I will not bring the money. But I swear, if you save my mother's life, I am going to bring this money to you. This time we are wasting to kneel down here. Use it to them for money. To save your life. There's no time. No time. No time. What is this? Is this the style I told you about? Is this what I asked you to do for me? The princess, I'm sorry, bro. I tried. You tried? How? I mean, what sort of nonsense talk is that? Oh, so you're using my hair to learn work, eh? Is that it? Goodness, what? When I walked in here, I asked for your auntie. You told me she wasn't around. I wanted to leave and you told me you could you could make it, you could even do it better than her. Now look at what you did to my hair. Is this what I asked you to do? My princess, please, I'm sorry. You're sorry. I am never coming to this shop ever again. My princess, you are here. You don't you don't look happy, who provoked you? Go in and ask your girl. Just look at what she did to my hair. Just, just, just look at this. I told her a style that I wanted and she told me she could make it perfectly. Now look at what she did to my head. Just, 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 what is this? I'm sorry. You get shit! What is this? Why did you make this style for her? Um, um, Jovita, please, I am not in the mood for this, your question and answer. Just know that this might be the last time I will come to your shop. Because what is this? Please, let's go. And see, I didn't know she was not going to like you. You didn't know she was not going to like you. Are you blind to see that the Esther you made for her is not good? You heard her? If the princess stops coming to my shop, you will not like what I will do to you. Sorry, sorry. sorry for yourself. Just hope that that you're sorry brings her back to my shop. Else. Doctor. 
please. We've done everything humanly possible. We can't raise this money. We've asked friends, colleagues. We've even asked uncles. They wouldn't help. Okay, doctor. We lost our dad. Losing my mother is not something we can carry. We don't want to be. We don't want to be in that mess right now. Please, I beg you. I have tried. You know I've tried for you. What else do you guys want me to do? You have to just do it. I, I know you can do it. You're a good Christian. Looking at you, I know you have a heart of gold. Please, just do it. Do the surgery for Mama. Okay, please. So, if you do it, or if you agree to do it, I promise you, I will work in this hospital. Yes. I will work as a gate man in this hospital. And my sister will even work as a cleaner to make sure that this bill is offset. Eh? We will pay the bill. Until we pay the bill, we will not leave. We will continue working. I promise you. God in heaven knows that I did not charge people. I did not charge you. Listen. Fibroid and appendix operation is not what every doctor can do. Yes. God in heaven knows that I did not charge you. Hmm? I did not. I don't ask for much. I only charged 260,000 naira after hearing your stories. And you are still here crying for help. What else do you want me to do? If you can do this for us, we will forever be grateful. Doctor will be indebted to you for life to say, oh, help save the life of our mother. Please. Please. Well, there's nothing I can do. Maybe I will discharge your mother to you so that you will take her to no. another hospital where no. they can operate her for free. No, yes. doctor. No, you can't uh, discharge Mama to us like this in this condition. Like, no, 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 but doctor, no, no, you can't do that. Doctor, I won't keep it in a Papa no Google now because you don't mind. I beg you. Can you guys leave my office? You we should leave your office. Yes. Just don't help us. I beg you. Please. Doctor, a man like you is kneeling for you. Please. Please, just. I'm so willing for her to help us. Please. I'm not God. I've told you what I can do for you. She's just leaving my office. I'm done. Nice. Thank you. Um, as usual. All right. Thank you. Please tell your friends about me. All right. What are we going to do? Where do we run to? Who do we ask for help? I can't believe this. I can't believe we lost our father because of money. And now my mom is critically down and there's no money to save her life. God. Tina, what is going on? What's the problem? Why are you crying? My prison, my... I'm in trouble. I'm finished. 
I feel like killing myself. You, look up. you need to calm down and tell me what is going on. I'm your friend and I'm a be of help. Okay? Now tell me what's going on. My princess. Yeah. My father. My father is dead. My father is dead. My father is dead. Where is he now? He's in the mortuary. Just, just wait for me, okay? Wait here. I'll be back. Just wait here for me. This is 100,000 naira. Give this to your mom. Tell her to manage it for now. Then I will come see you people later. You mean all of this? All of this for us? Yes. Just manage this for now. Okay? So much. Come on. God, please don't let this happen. Don't let this happen to us a second time. God, I miss Tina. Tina. I know the princess fights so much for us. But you can still, you can still call her. Yes, we need her help. We need her. I can't. We cannot keep running to the princess every time we have issues. Remember, she's just my friend. She's not family. This is not her responsibility. No. Besides, she's not even going to listen to us. Have you forgotten all she has done for us? She took care of our father's funeral, remember? What about the things she does for me? She paid my fees for the exam. She has, she has done more than enough. Tina, I know. But we are out of options. We, we, we've tried our best. Should we watch Mama lie there and die? So we can now start planning another burial? <sighs> oh no. I suggest you still meet her and ask for help. There is no harm in trial. Oh my God. Please. God have mercy. I cannot continue like this. If you want me to go myself, I can. I can't continue like this. No, where's my mom? Please. What do you think you're doing? I'm going for my morning jogging. Morning jogging? Yes. Where are your maidens? Dad, huh? do my maidens have to follow me everywhere I go? Why do you want to stress them jogging with me? Oh, Father, please just let them rest, okay? No. I'll see you. No. I'll no. see you, Dad. No. Dimma! Dimma! Hey, hey, hey! Guards! Come on, get the, get, get the key, get the key here! Come! 
me here. Come, come, come. Where are you? Follow Dima with that car. Right? As she jogs. If she gets tired, put her in that car and bring her back. Quickly, move, move. A princess. Yes. Good day. Good day. Um, you, you like sports? Yes. My princess, are you not afraid of this? <laughs> are you not afraid? Why did you stop the princess? Sorry, sorry, sorry. And who called you here? Hmm? Who called you here? Are you mad with something? Oh, so that's why you people follow me around? Huh? To know the people that I talk to or people that talk to me? Look, if you try this next time, if you try this nonsense, I will make sure I send you out of the palace. Now get out! Leave! Sorry for yourself. Um, so sorry for no, 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 no. I, I should be the one saying sorry for interrupting your workout. Oh, it's fine. So, what can I do for you? Uh, 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 my princess, please, can I talk to you? Okay. Um, I'm a hairstylist. My, my name is Chukuma. I own a hairdressing shop. Mm. Yes. Uh, uh, my name is Chukuma. My, my shop is uh, around the corner. Ah. Yes. The, the other day I, I saw you. You were, ha you were having issues with your hairstylist oh, Jovita. Jovita yeah. Yes, yes. It, it looks like they didn't do what you wanted them to do. Uh, yeah. my, my princess, I'm using this opportunity to tell you that I'm a hairstylist. If you just just trust me, I, I can make your hair. I'll, I'll make you look very beautiful. A female hairstylist. Yes, yes, yes. Hmm. So you're saying you can give me what I would like? Okay? Yes, yes. I I can make your hair look look, look really really nice. Hmm. A, a trial will convince you. Hmm. Okay, I'll give you a try. Thank you, thank you. Yeah, you said your shop is Yes, but my, my shop is around the corner and I live in this community, oh, my princess. Okay, yes. I see. So do I get your contact? Sure, sure, sure. My number is 80 362 55926. 362 55926. Yes, yes, yes. Okay then. My princess, um, yeah. will you come? I will, I'll come. Are you sure? Definitely. As long as you're a good hairstylist. I am. So, that's fine. Thank you. All right, then. Thank you, princess. Yeah. Bye. God bless you. Yeah. Why not run around and get this money and pay for the deposit so that your mommy's surgery will be done instead of standing there crying? Nurse. Nurse, we cannot afford this treatment. We cannot afford it. I am not working. My brother's business is not doing well. We don't have anyone to run to. There is nowhere on earth I can raise this money. We cannot raise this money. At the same time, I do not want to lose my mother. I understand you, <laughs> okay? I don't know what to say, but you have to do it. Your mommy's life is at risk. Just do something, okay? How is Mama? Why are you crying? How is Mama? Mama's condition is getting worse. Mama is not getting any better. 
find out this. Yes. <laughs> we cannot raise this money. We can't raise this money. Tina, you scared me. <laughs> oh, thank God she's alive. That she's not dead. I would have been going to Tina, at, at some point, I, I just blame you for everything. I mean, I've searched everywhere. I've, I've tried to borrow from my friends. I couldn't. I've done everything humanly possible to raise this money. I can't. I can't understand you. How do you mean? I mean, is this in any way my fault? I, I just blame you partially. You know, it's not totally your fault, but partially it's your fault. Tina, you have a friend, a good friend in the princess. Why don't you just talk to her and let her help us out of this situation? Are we going to continue like this? But why would be so ashamed of us? Ashamed of me, particularly. Isona, really? See now, the princess will help us. One hard the situation. Okay, with. Just stop. Isona, stop already. What are you even talking about? Have you forgotten so soon? Have you forgotten the princess's contribution towards our father's burial? Does she owe us any favors? I mean, she's just a friend, not a relative. How is this supposed to be her responsibility? No, tell me. Don't you think we're taking advantage of her? Do you want us to bother her and give it to my mother's health? Really? My princess, I do not know what to do. I am confused. The doctor has given us until today to raise the money. Otherwise, the doctor will stop treatment. I don't know where else to run to. Please, I beg of you, just help me. Tina. Yes. So you mean all these things have been happening to your mother? And you didn't tell me anything. Why? I'm sorry. I was going to tell you, but... What? What? How much is the money? Um, the money is 250,000 naira. Uh, but Tessie gave me 20,000. So all I'm looking for right now is just 230,000 naira. Please. Mm, 200. Your Majesty. You haven't gone to your shop? Uh, no, Dad. Um, <sighs> Dad? Dad? Please. My friend, she has a problem. Her mom is at the hospital, seriously sick. And the doctor wants to operate her for fibroid and appendix. They are asking for a deposit of 250,000 naira, Dad. And today is the last day. Um, see my daughter, uh, my level of cash flow is low now. So, um, there's nothing I can do now. Okay? Dad, no! Today is the last day. And she needs to pay the money so the doctor can start treatment. Dad, come on, please help her. My friend doesn't have the money. Do you know what it means to say that the level of cash flow is low? Okay. The level of cash flow, cash flow is zero. I don't have cash now. Excuse me, I have something I must do now. your mother okay you won't lose her I'll make a transfer what what 
you, you're gonna give me the money? Of course. I will. Oh my god. Thank you. Now, I will make the transfer so you go to the hospital, make the deposit so they can start treatment immediately. Thank you so much. Thank you. Hey. Hey, please, let's just commence with my mother's surgery. No, what, what is wrong with both of you? How can you just barge into my office without waiting for your son to see me? Uh, uh, Dr. Biko, now just huh? calm down. Calm down. This is not time for all of this. Uh, the, the money is complete, though. It's, it's very complete. I hope it's this sharp, money sharp. is complete. Doctor, it's complete now. Go on, Egan. I'm sorry. It's complete. Doctor, Let's start this thing. It's complete. Excuse me. So, you heard what I said? Just go to the cashier and make the payment. Please, the cashier. Doctor, let's go. It's outside. The cashier is there. Is Doctor, can we go now? Please? Let me come. The money is complete. Okay, now. I don't know. They are still in the theater. She's not out yet. I don't even know what is going on. I don't know if my mother is going to come back alive. She will be fine, okay? okay? She will be fine. Nothing will happen to Mama. Alright? Okay. 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 Where is the doctor? She's fine. Oh, fine. goodness. Hey. Doctor. Doctor. How is my mother? Your mother? Uh, our mother. Your mother yes. is fine. She's I am done with your pressure. Yes. So you're saying you're done with your pressure and Mama is fine. She's perfectly fine. Perfectly okay. So Are you serious? Oh, that, that was like, I'm not here now. Not yet. Not yet, please, eh? In the next 15 minutes, the nurse will bring her to the wall so you all can see her. 15 minutes. Are you doctor. serious? Hey! Are you okay? Doctor, you mean 15 minutes should be out. Yes, we can wait. Oh, my goodness. Hey! We can wait. Hey, 15 minutes. Wait. Hey, wait. Hey, nurse, I think it's 15 minutes. So. It's already 15 minutes now. Hey, well, it's 15 minutes already now. It's 15 minutes. Princess, I'm done. Wow. Exactly, exactly what I wanted. I'm impressed. <laughs> I am really impressed. Thank you. This is beautiful. So you're actually good at making hair. And I was busy wasting my money at your business place. <laughs> I am impressed. My princess, thank you so much for the compliments. I told you, whoever comes to my shop will leave very happy. And you have proven that. You have proven that. Thank you. And from now henceforth, you will be the one making my hair. Thank you very much. <laughs> You're welcome. I love it. It's so beautiful. Exactly what I wanted. Exactly. I'm honored. <sighs> okay, so how much? Um, my princess, I'm not going to charge you. Don't worry about giving me money. I don't understand. You mean you want me to leave without you collecting the money for your hair? I'm not complaining. It's fine. <laughs> oh, that's nonsense. That's nonsense because you deserve some money for this great work that you just did. So here, have it. Have it. Thank you. That's much. five thousand error. So, I guess I'll see you some other time. Thank you very much. You're welcome. Okay. Thank you. Where are my maidens? Have All right. a nice day. Thank you.
be. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Bless you, sweetheart. Thank you, Mom. Now, what is this? Oh, my hair. <laughs> you like? I like it. Mm -hmm. I love it. I know. You look beautiful. And guess what, Mom? Tell A me. A man made this hair for me. A man made this hair? Mm-hmm. Mbano, let me take a look <laughs> at it again. Yeah. This. This is super nice. Mom, this guy is extremely good. I can see that already. <laughs> wow. A man. A man. Mom, a man. Hmm. <laughs> That's nice. I love it. Thank you. Believe me, this is beautiful. I know you would like it. <laughs> and guess what? What? He said that? when next I come to his salon, yes, darling. he would make me something better than this. For real? <laughs> Now you're going to bring this man over to the palace to make your body look beautiful too. Of course. Ah. That's not a problem. Yes. Mm -hmm. But the thing is, he's a busy person. Ah. So? But I'll convince him. He has Why to Why not? Come. He has to he come, has please. To come. And make me look good. And believe me. Yes, mom. If I love the hairstyle, mm -hmm. I will pay him very well. I assure you, this person will give you exactly what you want. Ah. He will give... Don't worry, I'll bring it to the palace. No problem. All right, mom. All right. Kind of it's thing. all right, sweetheart. I'm coming. Okay, mom. Mm. Come on, Tina. You don't need to thank me. Hmm? My happiness is that Mama is fine. Thanks to that, you. That's the most important thing. All oh, thanks mm. to you, princess. It's not for you. Mm. You people are my family, and I will do everything for you guys. Thank you. <laughs> You're welcome. <sighs> um, Tina, I've been meaning to ask you, what is how it? about Charles? I mean, the guy that traveled abroad, your boyfriend. I mean, from what you told me the last time, you said he has made lots of money. Mm. So, what happened? That's the story I heard. Princess, honestly, I don't know what I ever did to Charles that he abandoned me in this country. Charles made a lot of promises to me. You are aware now. Yeah. All the promises to marry me, everything, just like that. Charles left and forgot about me. I don't understand. You know, wait. What is this? Oh, so you mean you have been processing your visa to travel out of this town? Leaving me in this village all this while and you didn't think it was necessary to tell me about it? My love, uh, my, my love, please, I... No, I, no, just make it make sense. Like, what happens to me when you leave? Uh, Are you serious? Uh, I'm really sorry, You have a visa to travel, leaving me behind? Obin, Obin, please, eh? It's okay, not... okay, so what happens to me? What about me? Hey. What about me? What about my, my feelings for you? Please. My love, please. I am begging you in the name of God, stop talking like this. Eh? I am doing this for our own good. I have really suffered in this village. Please now, my mate and friend are making it out there. I want to make it in life, please. Oh, really? Yes. And the only way you will make it in life is by leaving this country and leaving me behind. Yes. You know, this is not the first time men leave their spouses behind and never come back. I will not do so that. So you are planning to run away. You want to run and leave me no. for 10 years and I will not even hear from you. That's what you people do. Oh. No, no, my love. And my... that's what you are doing. That's... So you mean you planned this thing and you, are... and you perfected it up here? Uh, my love, please. Once I get there and make it, I will be sending you money. Eh? When I'm back, you will now get married. Oh really? Yes. You didn't wind me, Abby. You no. think I'm a fool, right? No. You think I'm a fool. I don't have my own sense on my own. I cannot reason and think things out. You will just land in that in that place. Now the next thing you go and mingle with all these white people and they will colour you from no. me. Oh, you think I don't know, my, right? You think I'm not smart. No, my love, because no, I live no. in the village, I don't have sense. Uh, my love, please now. Eh? Uh, Charles, like this? Charles, this is not nice, oh. I don't like this one bit. This is not even fair. Uh, First of all, I do not even believe anything you're saying. I don't trust it. My love. It is very easy for you to say, Oh, I'm going to come back, I'll come back and marry you. That's is you just saying so that you can leave oh, my love you and i know no, you are not going to come back don't you trust me huh? don't i you don't trust you i don't trust you i don't trust you my love please now eh? I, 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 I can't do this to you now you know now i hear you they please. whine me i hear you very well see and look see charles be don't pressure me don't pressure me. i don't understand you don't tell me you want to stop charles from traveling to abroad to go and hustle <laughs> 
Tessie, it's not like I do not want Charles to travel abroad and make something good out of life. No, that's not the case here. But what happens to me when he leaves? What happens to me in this village if Charles leaves me behind? Think about it. What am I going to do? That's why I want him to stay back. Think of something he can do from this village and make it. Or are you trying to tell me there's nobody in this village that has made it from this village? Is that what you're saying? People can live here and make it. That's all I want. Now, let me ask you. All this while he has been in this country struggling, what has he achieved? Nothing. Please, Tina. I beg you in the name of God. Leave Charles to travel outside and hustle like others. Charles, I know, will never leave you and get married to another woman. Be it white or black. Because I trust him. Tessie. Tessie, you don't know what you're saying. Tessie, you cannot trust a man. You're not even sure. You're just saying this. Is he not your man? You should know him more than I do. So I should let him go. Of course. You've been crying since yesterday. Stop, stop now. Let's hmm? come home. Come home. Don't worry, yeah? Stop crying. I will come back now. Huh. Uh, please, take good care of her for me, okay? You know she's my angel. She's all I have. Biko. No, you literally my angel for my... You know? Take care of me. My baby now. I got you, Maya. Maya, stop saying that, eh? Stop saying that. Between both of us, we take care of the other. I, I know, I know. Please, be petting her for me, baby. <laughs> I better enter the bike and go where you're going. Stop crying. Love. Hey, my love. It's okay now. Let me go. Let me go. Please, please. Eh? Let me go now. You see, you see, you're making the bike. It's not starting, eh? Here. Bye. Princess, you know the rest of the story. I don't know. I don't know what to do. I know nothing about Charles's whereabouts. Nothing whatsoever. No information, no phone number to reach him on, no news. The only time Charles called me was last year, early last year, to beg me to calm down that he'll be back soon and make everything right. Princess, it's been a whole year, four years, since Charles left me in this country. I don't know if this soon will ever come. It's okay, mm? it's alright. Let's just hope he comes. And fulfill his promise to you. Amen. You know, over there in abroad, life is really hard. Really? Yes. Life is really hard. If you don't know, you'll be able to so find. But let's just hope and pray, Charles, for you like that. Okay, I'm praying. Oh, amen. 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 Everything will be fine. Thank you very much. What would I have done without you? Mm. Thank you. Oh, I don't know what to say. Thank you so I have much. to go now. And if you want to wait, I'll tell her that I think it's in the house. I'll tell her that I think it's in the I do. I do. Thank you so much. Thank you. Wow. Wow. Thank you. Thank you. Wow. This. Mom, just look at you. This is so beautiful. Thank you. Your face has totally changed. I can't believe this. Honestly, this is beautiful. <laughs> Chuma, you did a great job. <gasps> Thank you. So tell me, where did you learn this? Um, 
I, I used to live in Ghana with my father before he died. So I learned how to do this in Ghana. Honestly, the person who taught you how to make hair must be a wonderful and talented person. I'm telling you. Thank you. You did a great job. I told you, Mom. I told you. My queen. Yes. I'm done. Listen, you have really tried. Thank you. Now Thank take you. a look at me. <laughs> I look much younger now. Oh. Ah, sweetheart. Yes. Now go to my room. On top of my wardrobe, you'll see a good post there. Open it, get 50,000 for him. But before then, get him a drink. My queen? Yes. 50,000 for this small walk is too much. Look at him. You even deserve more. This is super nice. I'll go get it. It's all right. <laughs> Sit. Sit. Wow. Tina, hi. How is Mama? You've been discharged from the hospital. Oh, that's great. You know what? I'm coming over to your place because I need to see Mama. Yes, I'm coming right now. All right, see you soon. <sighs> um, you girls can go in and rest. I have somewhere to go. But my princess, we can't allow you to go out alone. Says who? Aren't you girls tired of following me everywhere? My princess, we can't be tired of following you around because that's why we are employed. And besides, we'll be in serious trouble if we allow you to go out Precious. alone. Precious. If anyone asks of me, tell the person that I decided to go out alone. Now go in and rest. Let me have my bag. This is too much now. Uh -uh, all the fruits present, orangey, uh -uh, pineapple, is your cook. Even banana. Hey. Ah, princess, is this not too hey. much? It's not too much for mama. How hey. can you say that these are not too much? They're too much. You have done much already. <laughs> Hi, mama. Thank you so much. I don't know. I don't know how to measure the thanks. Honestly, honestly, I don't know where I could have been without you right now. Maybe I would have been in the grave. 
But it's true. Eh? Because my children told me the huge amount of money uh, uh, you brought to pay up for my hospital bills. Eh? It's too much. Hi. Look, I'm happy. My happiness is that you're fine and that you're okay. Hmm? So, Mama, don't worry about any money that I've spent. The most important thing is that you're fine. Oh? Thank you so much, my daughter. Thank you. You are a godsend. Oh, Mama. Mama, it's okay. It's okay. No, Mama is right. You're nothing but a godsend to my family. I mean, look at the measure of love you show us. We do not even deserve this. This is too much and you're still doing. Thank you. We can never thank you enough. Thank you very much. You people are my family. Okay? Thank you, Princess. Oh. You know, like Mama rightly said, if not for you, we would have lost her in the hospital. Yes, Mama would have you. died. Though. Yes. Thank you so much. Well, we thank God. <laughs> um, I have to be on my way. I just wanted to come and see Mama. Hey. Um, you refuse to take anything now. Hey. 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 Thank you, Mama. Hey. 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 Just be well, okay? Yeah. Right. Thank, you. Thank, you. Oh. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Mama, let me Bye. Mama. God will bless her. Who's that blessing? Who's that blessing? Hey! What is that? Princess. Hi, you're here. Yes, hi. Um, I, I came to see you. Okay. <laughs> and you know, I haven't seen you since uh, we last spoke. You didn't give me a feedback about my proposal towards you. Can I ask you a question? Yes. And I want you to be honest. Yes, yes, my princess. You, you, I'm ready to answer all your questions. Okay. Are you aware that I am a princess? Yes, I know. And then you slept and woke up. And you proudly made up your mind that you want to marry me. Huh? Yes, my princess. <laughs> so what makes you love me? Um, my princess, you see, the truth is, I fell in love with you from the very first time I, I saw you. Remember that day? That day you were you were you were jogging. No no the, the other day you were you were fighting with your hairstylist. I saw you and I, I fell in love with you. So out of all the beautiful girls we have in this community, you choose to love a princess. Because you're different, my princess. You're different from every other girl in this community. Are you aware the kind of father I have? He is a stubborn king. And if he finds out about this, he won't hesitate to put you in prison. And my princess, I'm ready to go to prison for your sake. Yes, I'm ready to die for your sake. Yes. You're ready to die for me. I'm ready to go to prison. You're serious? Yes, I am. Let's go inside. Mm Has -hmm. you come? Yeah. Chuma, are you here? Yes. What are you doing here? I mean, you didn't even tell me you were coming. I hope there's no problem. I I'm sorry I didn't tell you. It was an oversight. What happened? I, I, I came to ask you if um, you have told your parents about what we last discussed. 
the, my proposal to you. I, I because I would like to tell my mom too. But but, but I, I want to hear from you. Chuma, I think it's too early for that. It's too early for us to start telling our parents. You know we have a lot to discuss to to avoid regrets. Besides, you just came up with this idea a few weeks ago. But, but, but I, I, don't, I don't regret. I, I, I won't regret doing any of this. You sure? Yes. I'm very sure. It's okay, fine. Discuss with your parents and I'll talk to mine. Okay. I love you. I love you too. Someone that wants to see both of you. Who is that person and why does he want to see us? He's my friend. Your friend? Mm -hmm. Ooh. Princess? Mom? Are you now seeing a man? <laughs> Mom! Why? Am I not old enough to see a man? Hmm. Well... <laughs> well... He wants to come and ask for my hand in marriage. Marriage? Mm-hmm. <laughs> now hold it. Who is he? And what does he do for a living? Um... A woman... That question is not important now. Mm -hmm. Yes. Let the person come. Princess? Yes, Dad? Bring the person. Oh, Dad, you are the best. The absolute best. <laughs> I can't believe you. I'll bring him to the house. <laughs> just, hold on. Just like that. Bring him in. Mm -hmm. Like that. Dima, Mom, I hope this young man you're talking about is well to do. Um, Mommy, I'm off to the shop. Hi. Oh, Mom, I am not driving. You know, I don't like to drive. Come on, you have to. You're a princess. Bye, Mom. Bye. My son, this girl you always talk about, you say she is Igwe's daughter, the princess of this community. Yes, Mama. She loves me so much. <sighs> Love. Are you sure she will agree to marry you? Of course. Mama, she's accepted to marry me, but... But what? What about her parents? Digbe and Lola, will they allow their daughter to marry a poor boy like you? Eh? Mama, she promised to speak to them. She promised to tell them about my proposal. But I'm afraid. I hope they don't reject me because I'm a hairdresser. Hmm. My son, if you will listen to me as your mother, I will suggest you forget about all these rich men's daughters. Eh? Especially the princesses. They are always fond of themselves. You know, look for a poor home. Let's remain as we are. Please. Remember, she is a princess. And the father is the Igwe of this kingdom. Eh? As you can see, light and darkness has nothing in common. 
they are light and we are darkness. So, we are not the same level. Please, eh? And that Igbo is so mean. He hates the poor. Can't you see? Oh. Mama, when it comes to marriage, what will be will be. So don't worry. Mmm. Mmm. Okay. If you say so. But please, be careful. Be very careful. Welcome, sir. Uh, how are you? I'm fine, sir. Oh, very good. Okuru. Okuru. Anyway, it's fine. Exactly what I want. <laughs> Thank you, sir. Bring my bags. Okay, sir. Okay. 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 Yeah, but there you work out. My father traveled, but he'll be back tomorrow and he needs to rest. So, why don't we make it next tomorrow? Yes, next tomorrow is fine. <laughs> you want me to follow you, go see your mother tomorrow? Okay, I will see what I can do about that. Bye. I love you too. I'm, I'm fine. My mother is fine. Who is this? Eh? Onye? Sorry. You, you say what? Charles! Uh -uh. I'm sorry. Which, which of the Charles is this? My own Charles? Eh? Nigerian number now. Oh, you are back from abroad? Is your cool? Where are you? When did you come back? How? Your new house? Where, where is that? Please, then, just send me the address now. Now, now, let me just start coming. Send me the address now. No, no, don't worry about all that. Just ask me when I come. Let me just come and see you first. Hey, Mama. Mama, this is Charles. Charles. Charles now! You are Charles! My Charles! My, my, my husband to be! He, he's back from abroad! He just called me now! He said I should come and meet him in his new house! Hey! Which house is that? I don't 
no. He said his new house, so I said she sent me the address. So I can. Hey, Mama, see, let me just go and change, eh? Let me just change and dress up first. Okay. Let me take it easy. Let me just. Oh, no. Tina, please take it easy. Anyway, this is good news. This is good news. Uh -huh. After how many years? Wonderful. It's okay. Good afternoon, sir. Who are you and who are you looking for? Uh, my name is Tina and I am here to see Charlie. Charlie Charles. Uh, he asked me to come here. Well, he didn't tell me that he's expecting anyone. Hey. Uh, but actually, oh, actually, he called me this afternoon and sent me this house address. He said I should meet him here. So I'm very, very sure that he's expecting me. Well, if you're sure about what you're saying, can you call him on phone to confirm that? Eh, hey, I should call him. Why not? Hey! <clears throat> Hello? Charlie? Hey, Charlie, I'm, I'm here. Of course, now, live and direct at the address you gave me. <laughs> I'm here live. The guest man is here too. Oh, I should give him phone. Ha! Oh, young one, take. He said I should give him. He wants to talk to you. I told you. <laughs> I told Hello, you. sir. Yeah. Okay, sir. Hey, hey Charlie, one. So you should come. Right. I told you. Didn't I tell you? <laughs> I told you. actually stayed away for four years four years of no communication no call no text no mess like nothing I didn't hear anything from you and you were not bothered like how were you able to stay for that long without without even like how did you do it you, you, you left me here you didn't care about my feelings nothing you like you abandoned me totally ah, not like that now not like that then how like how Charles, do you know what I have been through in four years? Do you know what has happened to me in four years? I understand. Do you know what has... What, what, do, 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 you even, do you even have an idea? No, it's okay. It's okay. I understand. I understand what how you What do you feel. even understand, Charles? My love. My mother was almost going to die. My mother was sick at the point of death. She needed surgery. My mother would have died if not for the timely intervention of the princess who brought money. Because there was no money. No money whatsoever. Like we 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 have been feeding from hand to mouth. Hey. Is it my father? My father died, Charles. My father died because 
Because of lack of funds, there was no money to, 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 to treat him, there was nobody to help me. I went everywhere, I couldn't find help. My love, I, I understand. You do not understand because it's, it's very okay obvious to travel abroad and everything became rosy for you. You started living a life of affluence and wealth and everything. I mean, look at you it's now. Okay. It's look okay. at you, look at it's you, it's okay. obvious. I am here now, I am back. Not just that I am back, I am back for you and your family. Uh, you see, this era of poverty is gone. Eh? I am here for you, so don't cry again. Charles. Hmm. Charles, what other surprises are you going to come up with? Just surprise me now. Just shock me now. Let me, let me just shock the shock. Uh, which surprise apart from you and I? Charles, hmm? are you married with kids? Um, are you married abroad with kids? Uh, because I'm just wondering what, what you've been doing in, in that country for four years old. Me married to who? You are, the only, I know. you are the only one I love. Do I know? Did I follow you there? Did you not abandon me here? I did not marry anybody. You are the only one that I love. Are you sure? Yes. You I are the only one that, 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 that I, I'm the only one that you love. Yes. You did. Yes. And the only one that you love. You, you, you couldn't even you couldn't even send me how? Like not even a simple message in four years, child. Oh, four years is not four weeks. My love less than Buto. You won't understand. If I start to explain you. That one that one that, 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 that one will bust my head now. Don't 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 give me that you won't understand. Nonsense. What kind of you want? Am I, am I daft? Am I a child? Relax. What do you mean you won't understand? Yeah, Explain to me and I will understand. My love, yeah, you won't understand. Relax. Uh, did, you, did, you, did you commit crime and went to jail? No, you know me now. You understand? I mean, you know, meanwhile, I'm deeply sorry about the death of your dad. Uh, as for your mom, my in law to be, I will take good care of her and make sure that she lacks nothing. How is your brother, uh, Izuna? My brother went to Abuja. My brother went to see some of his friends to see if they can raise him some money to start up a business. Mm -hmm. Life has not been easy. Mm -hmm. We have been through a lot. And to even itself is, 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 is Wahala. Uh, don't worry. We've been through a lot. If don't I have worry. been through a lot, I know, left. I know. You it, don't know anything. It is over, my love. Me, you don't know anything. Relax. Ebu Zemunko, but good is over. Eh? The money is now too much. You don't bother yourself. Meanwhile, you call that your brother, let him come back. A wolf who can almost cook and big girl, let him go and start doing something. You understand? Don't worry yourself now, eh? We need to go shopping. You need to change all this. I don't like all this. See, 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 I've, I've not agreed. Though. I've not agreed. Though. Agreed. No, now. you have not. See, I'm, 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 you, you see, I What do you me. want me to buy for you? What do you, mm -hmm. what do you want? What name the team? Just look at you. You see me doing this shame for me. You, you see you. you see. Me, see, leave me. No, don't, 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 don't touch me. Leave me. I believe I won't hear about this spread. This place. <laughs> My private jet still intact. <laughs> Yeah, let me go inside. Oh, let me go inside. Let me go and check. Let me go and confirm my particular I'm still angry. I'm still angry. Which angry? Stop this thing. Look at this. Mama, you are rushing. Do you want this to do this or not? I want it. You want it. I want it. Mama, close your eyes. Mama, close your eyes. Okay. It's a surprise. Mama, when you hear Tana, you open your eyes. Mama, it's like you're not ready. You're not ready. Mama. Tana! Mama, it shocked you. Mama, this money is for us. You and I, Charles gave me this money. Whoa, mama, put it, mama, put it. Put your hand. Eh? You will not disappear. Touch it. This one is for us. Yes. Life and direct. Eh? <gasps> this bundle of money. Huge money. Mm -hmm. For us. Mm -hmm. I have not seen this before. Mama, you know, this is Nigerian currency. Naira. Naira, Nina. Cha cha. Naira. I'm telling you. Hey! So, Mama, I've not finished. 
listen to this. Chow said by next week he's coming to my people for formal introduction. Eh? Mm. Sharp, sharp. Mama, your daughter is getting married. You are getting married now, now. Mama, feel free to address me as Mrs. Charles. Oh, now, beg it, uncle, uncle. I am not a Uncle, 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 ma. A Mrs. in the making. Eh? Yes, so. Hey, we. Hey, hey. Mm -hmm. Something just came to my mind now. What is it? Eh, me. From this eh, month. Mm. Let's take later. Okay. Uh -huh. To buy no things so, uh, to go and appreciate the princess as we uh, talked before. Now that this money has come, let's uh, make little use of it. You can. Mm. Ah, Mama. Well, if you ask me, oh, I don't think all that would be necessary. I don't think it's necessary. Those people, they have money, they have everything. It's me, we, we don't have. Mama, mm -hmm. you, are, you cannot be giving rich men money. How much do you want to give them? Eh, eh, it's not measured that way. Ha. Mm -hmm. It is not done that way. You don't measure life in that way. Eh? No, you have to appreciate somebody. Even God himself said we should appreciate. Okay, look at what Jesus Christ did those days. Mm -hmm. You are reading your Bible now. What did eh? he do? He healed ten persons. Mm -hmm. Only one came back to say thank you, sir. Mm -hmm. And he asked. We are the nine Did the others die? They did, did the others die? die? You will not die if you did not appreciate it. Hey. But it is still not good. Here. Hey. For, uh, for us to go and go there and say, hey, please, we thank you for what. No, 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 no. My mind is not set up. If this money has not come, come, see, Mama, see, when God is answering your prayer, God is giving you money to settle your life. Eh? Hey. To settle your life. You have to settle yourself first. Wait a minute. This is part of the settlement. If you go and appreciate whom God has used to bless you yesterday, that person will have more strength to bless you more okay, now. Fine, fine, Mama, fine. Since you insist, oh, if you insist, okay, we'll just take small. Maybe like five pieces. I don't know what your plans are. I don't know what you plan on buying. No. If otherwise, me, if you ask me, there's even no need. No problem, eh? Mama, let's go and celebrate and enjoy our money. Eh? Okay. Hey! hey. We are rich, oh. Mama? Hmm. Come on, sir. This is Dima, the princess I told you about. Oh, you are beautiful. Good day, Ma. Welcome, my daughter. <laughs> you make a nice right there. Hey, <laughs> you are welcome. Hmm? Thank you, Ma. My son has always said a lot about you. Hmm? Even how you gave him money the last time. <laughs> so find something for me. <laughs> he told me. <laughs> You're welcome, Ma. Uh, but my, uh, I'm afraid, you know, because of your parents, did and wrong. <sighs> Mama, my parents won't be a problem. Mm. Yes. Hmm. I want told my son to pick a wife for my poor family so that things will be easier for us. Mm? Mama, mm. don't worry. My father, the Igwe, is a good man. Ah, good man? Yes. Hmm. Anyway, once again, you are welcome. Soon. Take your hand now. This is where we will be. Let him take your hand. Oh. Well, I like it. Hmm. <laughs> uh, Royal Highness, we should be here. It's well, okay, na, uh, na, dalu, oh. Okay. His eyes. Yes, it will soon be here. Okay. Okay, but Neil, we asked him to call the princess. He's talking about his majesty. We didn't come here to see his majesty now. Tina, don't worry. You worry too much. Mm. Eh? Anyone that comes out is still the same. We came to thank them. It okay. must not be only princess. Uh -huh. yes, ah. Your Majesty. Good day, Your Majesty. Good day, Your Majesty. Good day, Your Majesty. Good day. I remember you. 
You were here once. Yes. My daughter's friend. Yes. Exactly. Sina. Yes, Your Majesty. Ah. I remember you talked about your mother, your mother's illness. Exactly. <laughs> <laughs> you remember, Your Majesty. It's me. I see. Yes, so, Your Majesty. So how is she now? Ah, she's perfectly okay now, to the glory of God. And today, she's here with me. <laughs> <laughs> this is my mother. Mm. Woman, you're fine now. Exactly, Igwe. Yes. I, I, I thank God I am okay now. That's why my daughter and I have come to uh, thank your daughter, I mean the princess. Mm. Yes, because um, she was the one that paid for my operation in the hospital. Yes. Really? Mm -hmm. <laughs> oh, Lori. Munez. Good day, ma. Good day, Your Highness. Yes. Good day, Queen. Good day, my Queen. Yes. Your Majesty. This man has shouted my name, I hope. All is well. The woman has something to say. My Queen. Good day. Yes. <laughs> Good day, my Queen. You're welcome. What were you telling my husband? Uh, my Queen. We were telling him about how your daughter, I mean, the princess paid for my operation in the hospital. Yes. Yes, yes. If not for your daughter, I would have been a dead person by now. She came to my rescue. Honestly, we are very grateful. Yes. And that's why my daughter and I have uh, come with this little gift to say a very big thank you to her. You know, appreciation is good when somebody do good to you. Exactly. You understand? Yes, yes, so that's why we are here to appreciate her. To say thank you even to you people. In fact, let me tell you, she has been of a good help to the family. Honestly. She was even the one that sponsored uh, my uh, my late husband's burial. Yes. Honestly. Yes. She's been nothing but she, uh, a blessing. Wonderful person to my family. In fact, my prayer unto her is that God in heaven will bless her with a wonderful Amen. husband. Amen. Yes. <laughs> that Lord will, oh. <laughs> you mean my daughter did all these things for you? Ah, yes, you my know? friend. Hey, and many more, self. Many yes. more. In fact, our mouth cannot even mention. Our mouth cannot mention. Woman, thank you for coming. Thank you, thank sir. Thank you, Your Majesty. Um, you may go. Please go with this. Uh, Gifts, the plantain, the fowl. Go with them. No, no, Igwe. We came to thank your daughter with this. No, 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 no. We can't go back with Madam. it. Madam, no, no, no. Now, no. what my husband is trying to say is, you need it more than we do. So go. When my daughter returns, we will deliver your message. Mm -hmm. ah, but it would have been nice if we leave it behind so that when she comes she will see the things we brought. Mm -hmm. Hey, he said you should go with them. Please. Mm -hmm. Hey. But I don't have one more turn and I'm not. Oh. Hey. No, I'm not don't worry. Let's go. We'll come back again when she comes back. We'll bring. We'll bring them back. Thank you, okay. my queen. Hey. <laughs> it's okay. You take it easy. It's Thank very you. heavy. Uh, <laughs> Thank you, Igwe. Thank you, Your Majesty. Thank you. Thank you. Mama, let's go. Okay. We'll come back again when she comes back. Da no no oh.
I'm sure you had that woman and her daughter. That's what Dima has been doing. Squandering her money on useless families. Honestly speaking, Your Majesty, I do not believe that woman won't bet. Well, if you don't believe her, you saw what the woman came with. A big bunch of plantain and a big fowl. Those two things are tested to one fact. Demar has been lavishing goodies on them. No, Your Majesty, please. I need you to calm down. At least let her come back first. You ask her before, you know, you start crucifying her. Remember Dima is our daughter. And you know that she's... She's kind-hearted. Like you? Well... Me, yeah. Kind hearted people are foolish. Foolish? Mama, what is it? You don't look happy. Mama, did you did you notice anything at the palace? Like what? You didn't notice anything in the Igwe and the Lolo. No. The looks on their faces, the way they were looking at us. I got the feeling that. The Igwe is not happy to hear that the princess has been giving us money and helping us. Because I remember the day I was there to beg for, for, for money for your, for your operation. The Igwe almost sent me out of the palace. So I noticed, in fact I understood the look when I saw it. He was smiling but I know that that smile was so pretentious. Like he was just faking it. And then the queen, she just kept looking and asking questions and talking soft, but Mama, when you look into their eyes, eh, you will see that. It's almost as if we have put the princess in trouble. Though. I really just hope she's not in any form of trouble because of this revelation, because those people are not happy. Do you know your problem? What, Mama? You worry too much. How can we put her into trouble? We did not put Princess in any trouble. Igwe is very happy that his daughter helped us or did something good for us. And he's happy we came back to appreciate. But yet, they refused the gifts we brought. Explain it. They rejected the gift mm -hmm. because they have enough. No, because they didn't welcome us. No. Have you forgotten that the Igwe sent me out of the palace? I've almost sent me out when I went begging for money for your, for your hospital bill from the princess. So I don't think that man, I don't think they are happy. They rejected the gift because they have enough. Ah. And that shows that they are not greedy. That's just it. Stop <sighs> worrying. Mama... <sighs> No, Mama, no, that's not true. Mama, how... Stop worrying yourself. But how come you didn't... Mama, see... You see... Mama, see, eh? I can't be wrong on this. Dad. Mom. I've heard both of you. But I want to ask this question. Is it wrong for me to help people in need? Is it wrong for me to help people that that are sick 
and I can't afford proper medical care? Because all what you people are telling me doesn't make sense. Tina is my best friend. Her mother was hospitalized at the point of death. Are you saying I shouldn't give her the money and let the mother die? Because it doesn't make sense to me. You people are wrong. Totally wrong. Are you now a bank <laughs> that lends people money? No, that I am not a bank. But I have the money that can be used to save that woman's life. And I'm happy she's alive. I'm happy she's okay. Dad, you are the Igwe of this kingdom. It is your duty to ensure that the people are well taken care of. That's what makes you a good leader. And you, Mom, you're not doing your job as the queen of this kingdom. Your duty is to make sure Dad carries out his duty to make sure that the people of this kingdom are well taken care of. Well, if you both don't know your duty, I know mine. And I will make sure that the people of this kingdom are happy. By squandering all your money, squandering, spending even, even your capital, the capital of the business you're doing. What a shut up! What has come over you, young lady? Did you see the way I've been looking at you since? Are you mad? How dare you speak to your father in such manner? Have you forgotten your father is the ego of this kingdom? Eva. No, Eva. apologize to him at once. Eva. Father, I'm sorry for what you I'm sorry, Father. Forgive my manners. But that won't stop me from helping the people. your mother do? Why did you bring gifts to the palace? Look, because of that, I'm having issues with my parents. They just called me a few minutes ago and started crying with me. Tina, you shouldn't have done that. Look, whatever I do for you people, you don't need to come and show me appreciation. You don't need to do that. It's okay. I said it's okay. How is Mama? Okay, I'll come see you people later, okay? Alright. Bye. Your Majesty, good, good day, my queen. Good day. The hairdresser guy, yes, yes mom, yes. that made my hair. Yes, mm -hmm. exactly. I still look good. Uh, I didn't ask you to come. And I know my daughter normally comes to your salon to make her own hair. Well, exactly. mm, so, mom, you're right. Yes. But he's not here to make my hair or your hair. Yes. Oh. I'm so. here for something more important. So, what are you here for? He came for me. Yes, I came for her. How? Give him the drink. The drink, yes. I should give him now. Uh, yes. Okay. Your Majesty. Your Majesty, my king. This drink is for you, sir. It's a gift from me to you. It's called Omega H3. It's one of those expensive drinks befitting for a king, sir. <laughs> Omega! Omega H3, ma. What oh. a cheap drink! No, 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 it's not cheap. It's very expensive. I bought it for 2500 Um, Dad, Mom, you know, a few days ago I told you someone would be coming to ask for my hand in marriage. 
He's the one. I'm here. Oh, just hey, shut ma. up! Now what is this? Ma? Are you insane? No, ma. Are you mad? No, she's not ma. Ma, she's saying the truth. She's not joking, no. What ma? truth? I, I came to marry her. Your Majesty! Did you hear what your daughter said? That Chuma is here to ask for my hand in marriage. Exactly. Jesus. He's here to ask for my hand in marriage. And mom, why are you making your face like that? Why what? Come on, hey, Christ. A saloon boy. Ma, I, I love your daughter. We're perfect um, for each other. Woman. Uh, don't worry, let me take it up from here. Oh. Mm. Young man. Sir? What's your name? Sir? What is your name. My, my name is Chukuma, sir. Chukuma, Chukuma. Where are you from? Oh, okay. I'm from Agule, is a village. It's a, it's a neighboring village. Just very close by. What do you do for a living? Sir, I, I'm a professional hairdresser. I, I make women look beautiful. Oh. Baba. No, sir. I, I make. I make. He makes ladies' hair. Sir, I, I, I made your daughter. He hair. made my hair. Oh, just shut up. Who are your parents? Uh, uh, sir, my father is dead. He died a long time ago. Oh. But my mother is still alive and I live with her. We both live with my late father's younger brother. We live in his house. But my, my, my mother is a trader. She, she sells vegetables in the market. Vegetables? Vegetables. Ugu leaf. Oh, Ugu? Yes, Ugu. Yes. Sir, your daughter and I, we love each other so much. We, we can't wait to start having children. So we're going to have light-skinned kids. Keep quiet! Jesus, Let sir. me do the questioning! Sorry, sir. Do you have a running mouth? No, sir. Do you have a drooling mouth? No, sir. I was only going to say that she, she said she would like to be, be like the queen and I said I would like to be like the king. Did you know she is the princess if i know she's a princess of course i know she's a princess and that's one of the reasons why i, I want to get married to her so, so that she, she can become the queen and i can become the king sir. a god digger are you a gold digger gold digger no do I, you dig gold no i'm a hairdresser sir i don't dig gold sir you're not a gold digger no 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 i've never seen gold before do you know you're fishing in troubled waters not a fisherman, no. Dad. Mom. I love him. Uh, well, the young man has just come. I love you too, baby. Hmm? So, make him come. I mean, I mean, bring food for him to eat. Thank you very much, sir. Really? Sir, 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 you're a good king. Make him comfortable. Comfortable? Thank you very much, sir. You're a good king, sir. Make him relax. Relax? Thank, thank you, sir. Ah! Ah! What is this? Dad! 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 Come back here! What are you doing? If you talk again. If you talk again. If you talk again, you will taste the split. You will taste the split. Dad! Is anything wrong with you? Are you trying to kill my husband to be? Are you normal? Are you okay? Dad! Talk to 
Your daughter is here, Your Majesty. Princess. Princess, I did not sleep last night. I couldn't. Not after what happened yesterday. I replayed the events of yesterday. Wandering princess, whether you were under a spell, <laughs> were you bewitched? I mean, did any person or group of persons or anything bewitch you? I mean, making you senseless, rendering your head empty, bent. That is like your head is now conquering without anything. Are you normal? Are you normal? Or are you trying to tell me that what happened yesterday happened in your with you and your eyes wide open? Eh? Are you in your right senses? <laughs> oh, why you see, are you not well king man? Or did you get your own head from? You should have told me that your daughter was ripe for marriage. I should have been told you were ready for marriage. Yes. Do you know that as a father here, I plan whatever that goes on in this palace? Of course. I plan it. Nothing happens by chance. No. We plan it. We design it. And that includes your own marriage. Your room, your room marriage has been planned from beginning to the end. That's right. The person that will marry you how he will marry you, where he will marry you, who and who will be there for your marriage. Everything was planned before now. I have planned your own marriage to be with a senator's son. If you have told me that you were right for marriage, then I would have Sent for my good friend, Senator Frederick, to come in with his son. In fact, as we speak, I will have to bring him in by next week. He will come in with his son. He's a senator of the Federal Republic. And his son is the person that will marry you. So, get ready. And what if I say I do not want to marry your so-called Senator Frederick's son? Hey, <laughs> banana. Mbali. Mbali. No, my daughter. You will not say it. Because if you do, oh, you will never like 
the actions your father will take. You won't. You won't. I will not marry him, father. I will not. I have someone that I love. Someone my heart yearns for. And that is Chuma. And there is nothing you can do to stop me. Not even your wife, my mother. Enough! Enough of this madness, young lady. What has come over you? How dare you raise your voice in such manner towards your father? Are you mad? Are you bewitched? Or what? How dare you? Now I need you to open your eyes because you are blind. You are blinded from seeing the truth. And that's it. How dare you? You want to settle down? You want to marry who? I beg your pardon. An ordinary, a classless young man, saloon boy, oh, that collects one more night of 50 kobo. That's who you want to marry. And you are ashamed of yourself. Now you listen to me, young lady. You are going to marry Sinister Son Alexander's final. If you don't, come back from what you have said. I mean, if you don't come back to your senses to marry Senator Son Alex. I will allow your father to deal with you. Take his actions and you unbelieve your mind, young lady. I will not stop him. Now let me ask you both. Do you think that at my age and my exposure in the society, I do not know what is good for me? No. I do not know what is right? Oh no, then. You do not know. Because obviously, you are blind. You are blind to see the truth. So we heard what Father said. Which is? That he's keeping a soul called Alex for me. You don't mind it if I like him or not. Someone I haven't even seen. Someone I do not even know. And you expect me to accept him. And don't someone. Someone my heart yearns for. For well, sorry that won't work. It will. It will. Not. It will. Now, Mom, Mom, just stop! Enough! Enough! Enough of this discussion. How can you say enough of this discussion? Now, keep quiet! I hope there is no problem. What are you boys doing here? Well, my princess, the Igwe has instructed us to lock up the shop huh? and return the keys to him. To lock up my shop? It's a passionate appeal. At the same time, he commands you. What sort of talk is that? I don't understand. What, what, what do you mean lock up my shop? My princess, you heard him. It's an order from your father. Are you not afraid? Huh? How dare you come to my shop to tell me this rubbish? Are you mad or something? With due respect, my princess, we are not leaving this place without locking up the shop. And of course, returning the keys to him. Come on, get out! Like I get said, get out! It's a passionate appeal and at the same time, a command. Why would my father ask you to come and lock up my shop? My princess, why don't you go back home? I found out for yourself. You can leave. I will do it myself. Sorry, my princess. Do not allow me to leave. Peace. Mm, you must tolerate her. She is living her life. Uh. Don't think otherwise. You may see party something. Uh. So, did you lock that shop? Yes, you did. Yes, you did. No matter what you do to her, she can change her time. And where's the princess? We don't know, my queen. We don't know. But as, as at the time we locked the shop and left, she was standing outside in one of the medias. Alright. Leave us two of you. Now, 
did you think what you did was the best? Yes. That will make her come back to her senses. I don't think so, Your Majesty. I think the best thing you should have done was to call her first. Talk to her before locking up her shop. Says who? Shut up. I'm sorry. Because you do not know the value of that shop. All you do is open the shop, plunder the shop, squander the money on low lives, all in the name of helping them. That's all you do. Henceforth, the shop remains locked. And you come back into the house and stay here. Yes. I'll take care of you. So this is it. So because I help people that are in need. People of this community that you are ruling. That's the reason you lock up my shop? No problem. It's fine. You can lock up the shop as long as you want to. But that will stop me from helping people. What is wrong with you, Dad? Look, even if it warrants me to sell my clothes as giveaway price just to raise money to help people, I would do it, Dad. I would do it. My princess, you do not stop. Talk to your husband. Because if by tomorrow he doesn't open that shop, I will... I will reserve my comments on that. You had better open up my shop. I call the both of you to sound a note of warning. I do not want you girls following me around. Okay? I do not want you girls following me around. I go out alone and come back alone. If you're looking for someone to follow, you can do that to my mother. Have I made myself clear? Yes, yes my, my princess. princess. My princess. You know following you around is why we were employed into this palace. And that's where we earn our living as well. Besides, your mother and the evil will not take it lightly with us if we stop following you around. I'll pay you off. Yes. So that you both can look for something to do. Look for something to help yourself. Or better still, you can join those following my mother. Oh, my God. This discussion is over. See me in my room in a few hours time. Did you say that your father asked the guards to lock up your shop? Yes, but that's not a problem. My only problem is, is you. Are you ready to fight this fight for love? Because I foresee a war coming. I know my father very well. My father is not an easygoing person. My father is very mean. I should be asking you, are you ready to fight? Because I am ready to die for your sake. I love you and I can die for you. And I love you too. And I promise you that nothing could separate us. Promise. <laughs> that reminds me, where are your mates? I sacked them. I don't need their services anymore. You sent them away? Why? Because I need privacy. I don't need them following me everywhere I go. Why? 
So can I be your maid? One of your maids. <laughs> <laughs> okay, that means you have to write. Okay. She asked you people to stop working for her. Is that it? Yes, my queen. She even pressed some of us that follow her off and asked us to leave. That's why we decided to come and see you first. Can you imagine? So, where is she? She went out to your majesty. Out? Alone? Yes, yes your, your majesty. majesty. Obviously alone. Of course, look at them. Alright. You guys can go back to your quarters. I'll handle it when she returns. Hmm. Your Majesty, what is come of this girl? Hmm? What is all this? It's very clear that she is beginning to see a man. Yes. The handwriting is clear. If that girl does not take time, I will forget that she is my daughter and treat her anyhow. Deal with her squarely, such that she will regret. Talk to your daughter. Mama, uh, what I'm trying to say is that you will tell your kinsmen that I will be coming back here with my own people in nine days' time. Uh, you know, I want to finish up with everything that has to do with the marital rights. I will be going back to abroad soon, and you know, I want to finish up with everything that has to do with the marital rights, so that you and my wife here will move into my mansion. You know, Mama, I can't have such house there, and you and my wife will be staying here. I am not comfortable with that. Mama, did you hear that? Can you hear your in-law talking? <laughs> hey. I'm out ears, my daughter. Oh. I'm out ears. Uh, so, my son, what you are saying is that um, uh, 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 my daughter and I should leave this house and Come and live in your house at the city. Exactly, Mom. my in-law. Exactly. Yes, you know, I don't like this place. I am not comfortable with this place. You know why I'm asking? This is my late husband's house. Where? So, I don't know how my uh, uh, husband's relatives, I mean the woman, don't know how they will see it, that I, Florence, uh, uh, left the, uh, my husband's house with my daughter and went to my... Uh, uh, a son's in laws house in the city and the last and be enjoying life. Mama, Mama, Pia. Mama, no. mm, 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 I don't like this line. Mama, do not spoil my happy mood for me. I'm using God to beg, beg you. Which one is who mourners? Oh, so we suddenly have who mourners? Eh, husband's relatives. Where were they when you were almost dying? Where were they when you were sick? Where have they been since your husband died? Ma, please, though. Please, don't come and put aside my gary. Oh. Please, don't come and spoil this my happy mood. This sweet and honey that God has put in my mouth. Please, don't come and mix it with bitter leaves. Uh, I am using God to beg you. Please, oh, please. Here. Uh, mama, ah. mama, uh, you have heard what your daughter said. Um, like I said, I will be going back to Kuwait very soon. So, I need to finish up with everything that has to do with the marital rights so that my wife here and you will move into my mansion. You understand? I can't have such mansion there and you and my wife will be staying in this hell called house. Hello! Big, in fact, big hell fire! That is what it is. Hell! Uh-uh! My son, I fed you. Okay. Mm -hmm. There's no problem. Mm -hmm. Whenever you are ready, 
Come and thank us. Uh, and again, Mama, uh, I need everything to be fast. In my own mogi, I don't have time. And I want everything to be monetized. Oh, <laughs> Mama, did you hear that? Monetization. Every nine days old. Let yes. us monetize everything. Sharp, sharp. Uh, hey. Okay. What is that? Uh, Mama, I, I hope you have eaten something today. <laughs> I have eaten. Okay, okay, okay. from dressed like this. I went to see a friend. A friend? And which of your friends did you visit leaving your maidens behind? Mom, must you know all my friends? And besides, I don't need the maidens to follow me everywhere I go. I don't need that. Madame, hold it! I hope! You didn't go to visit that good for nothing, no lies hairdresser. I'm asking you. And what if I went to see him? Hmm? What if I went to see him? Is he not a human being? Look, I just got back. I need to rest. No, listen. No, listen. No, lady. Warn you about that low life, that boy. Keep your distance from him and get ready to welcome my friend's son, Alex, the senator's son. They will be coming here in less than a few days. Of course. Are you threatening me, father? Take it any way you want it. No. I mean it! Mother, did you just hear what Dad said? He's threatening me! <laughs> Great. You know what? You both can do whatever you like. Because nothing on earth will make me get married to your so called senator son! Nothing on earth! Now, get out! I'm senator son! Up to your room! Go get inside! And Dad, please tell your guys to come open up my shop because they can't say I don't do nothing. Tell them to go open up my shop. Did you not hear me? Your Majesty. Nothing. Nothing? Did you just say nothing? Have you forgotten how stubborn your daughter is? My princess, I have been to your shop several times. The shop is locked up. What happened? My father. Mm -hmm. He just woke up one morning and ordered his guards to go lock my shop. Uh -uh. And I don't know why. Just like that? Just like that. You mean nothing happened? Nothing happened. Nothing. He just, he just asked them to go lock up my shop without even telling me anything. Good day, Your Majesty. Good day. What are you doing here? I said, what are you doing here? Father, Father, why are you embarrassing my friend? Don't you know her? She's Tina. It's Tina, you don't remember? I do not want to see you anywhere near this palace, ever again. 
Do I make myself clear? Father. Father, why are you doing this? Why? Oh, you're still there. Uh, Father, don't do this. You are still there. Father, stop embarrassing my friend. God. Hey. hey, you. Father. Father, why are you doing this? Why are you... Father. Come here. Come here. Come here. See that idiot. Do not ever want her across the street. I said, Lul! Wait! Don't, don't even dare touch her! Father, why are you doing this? Why are you embarrassing my friend? Why are you trying to frustrate me? Why? Go into the house now. Go in. Ah! <laughs> when did you come back? Daisy! Hey? I came into the country since two weeks ago. Uh, you mean your friend Tina did not tell you that I'm back? Tina did not tell me anything. I'm even surprised to see you. Ah, we are even planning on getting married though. Yes. Uh, anyway, she is your friend. You guys can settle whatever that will be. Uh, how are your parents? They are fine. They are fine? Um, Percy, you know you are a very good girl. Huh? Just have this. This is that good care of yourself. Thank okay. you so much. God bless you. You are welcome. You are welcome. God I, bless and you. One more thing. All this for me. It's all for you. Yeah. One more thing, please. I don't want to look for you on our wedding day. Don't worry, I'll be there. I'll make sure. Make sure. Very, very important. Tessie, Tessie. I'm rushing down to Zongo here. Bye bye. Take good care. Oh. Uh -huh. I saw your friend on my way coming to this place. If you see the way she was shouted, myself was even surprised. That's what? Haven't you told her that I'm back and our marriage and all Is it by force? Stop this line now. And uh, uh, what is the big deal? What is the big deal there if I don't tell her that my, my husband to be is back? Uh, is, that, is that a big deal? Please, though, just say something else. Uh, uh. Uh, uh, but she is your friend. Mm -hmm. She's my friend. Is she your friend? Uh, uh. Please, let me even ask you a question. Is friendship by force? Or I do not have the right to denounce my friend. <laughs> or, or, or I don't have the right to keep my private business to my private self. Or is it by force that I go around the village announcing to the whole community, and eh, please come, oh, my, 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 my husband to be is here and I'm getting married. Uh, is it by force? I don't want to announce it. I choose not to announce my progress. Okay. I want to move in silence. Uh, I know you have every right to keep everything private, but at least you should have told her um, that your guy is back, you know, those kinds of things. So you're still insisting on this line? Ah. Wait, you are still pushing this thing? I'm sorry, Lamu. Ha! I'm beginning to suspect you. No, no. Mm -mm 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 -mm. This cannot be for nothing. Mm. I'm beginning to suspect you. Because ever since you made this money and came back to this community, I know that all these village girls will be flocking around you. I know. <laughs> but let me tell you, <laughs> I have my eyes like this on you. I am looking at you on a 3D. Ah. See, if you, if you, you will not even try me. <laughs> don't, don't think you can, you can, <laughs> you cannot, any, if I see any, any zigzag movement. <laughs> you will not even try it because if you try it, eh, eh, if I catch any girl around calm in this down. village, may I'll pour them hot water. My love, calm down. Don't, don't, don't my love me. I'll pour them hot water. Uh, I've told you. Uh, don't my love me. Oh. I, I think it's like, it's like, it's like you have feelings for that, my friend. Nothing, my love. There's not, you, you, you're you the only one I love now. <laughs> uh, anyway, she is your friend. You guys can start do whatever problem you have with your daughter. Yeah? Uh, how is mama? Yeah, it's now you're asking me, how is Mama? Mama is fine, she just stepped out. Uh, there's no problem, yeah? I am really sorry. Yeah? Anyway, I'm rushing down to some. Once I'm back, come and sit and talk, okay? Talk more, okay? My husband. <laughs> See the husband that God gave me. <laughs> hey, very handsome man. So and rich. <laughs> <laughs> I love you. I, I am God's you gift to you. In fact, God compensated you with me. Seriously? <laughs> I'm telling you, it's your food. Hey, go, go, my, my, hey, my husband. My oh, husband. Yeah. Now, my perfume is here. Hey. If you come back, I want to smell it. Hello, brother. Do you smell it, Mama? Do you know the fire pepper? Uh, good, good, good. I trust you, my husband. I know husband. what you want. Don't hey, me. I love you. Oh, my. This is good. Oh, my. You, you. I will kill you with love. I will choke you. <laughs> Chai. Yeah, 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 yeah. Let's go. 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 Let's go
deceive the artist. Let me just ask you a very simple question. As you can see, I'm not even in a good mood at all. Please, oh, what was that nonsense? You were telling my fiance on his way to my house. That rubbish you were saying. Please, can you explain to me what is the meaning of that nonsense? That arrant nonsense. See now, what did you just say that I told you? Oh, you are questioning me. Yes, I'm asking you. Oh, you are suddenly for. Oh, you have memory loss, Opia. Yeah? You are asking me what you told Charles. You have forgotten yourself. Of course, I still remember what I told I you. I said, if you remember, then go ahead and start telling me. That is why I'm here. I want to know. I want to hear from the horse's mouth. He saw me on the road and stopped to greet me. Uh -huh. So I was surprised to see him because you never told me that he's back. That's all. And so what? No, no. And so what? And so what about it? Look at the way you are feeling so, so pompous. And you never told me that he's back. So I should tell you that my fiance is back. On what ground? Tina, are you the one talking I to me like this? I am the one talking in my full glory. Why are you the one talking see? to me like this, Tina? I, I, do I owe you? No, 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 that's it. Do I owe you? Wait, do I change that for you? Abby? Do I owe you anything? Tina, after everything I have done for you, what did you do for me? This is how you are going to pay me back. Have you forgotten when Charles wanted to travel? Uh -huh. You refused. I was the one that pleaded with you for your own good. Mm -hmm. Now he came back mm -hmm. and made money. Uh -huh. I became your enemy. Uh -huh. I can see, you see, I can see you have big eyes and you have your eye on my man. It is obvious. From your tone mm -hmm. and your body language, it is, it is, it is obvious now. Mm -hmm. You did not only advise me, you also bought him flight tickets to travel. Why did you add that? Did you buy him flight tickets? So let me tell you, I can take anything from Sina, you. you are very wicked. I can take anything from you. You are very wicked. You have to. This is how you are going to pay me back. Listen and listen very, very good. Testy, see from your body language and everything you are saying, all this nonsense you are speaking from your mouth, eh? I have seen one thing that you have your eyes on my fiance. Oh, yes, you have your eyes on him, but let me warn you. See, I am going to take anything from you. I respect our friendship, no doubt. But it's when it comes to my man. <laughs> when it comes to Charlie Wam, you cannot, oh. See, if you have any anki panky in your heart, if you, you see, if you. See, let me just give you one last one. If you see my fiancé coming like this, eh, 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 you tilt to this side. If you see him coming from this side, you tilt to see if I catch, if I, if I see you close to him again, eh, Tina, uh -huh. all these things you are vomiting here, uh -huh. all these insults you are giving me today, mm. I promise you one thing, you will surely regret it. Holy God, fire! If I you will surely regret see, it. Tessie, see, take it back to send down your head. Get out. I should get out. I can't get out! Yeah, what hmm. This one is What is this? Uh uh. That means another set of earrings. <laughs> this one in your ear? Yes, sir. I told this you. This will break your ear. It will not break. Fashion is pain. You don't know. Fashion is pain. <laughs> All for fashion. See. Um. Hello. My princess. Uh -huh. Hi. How are you? How are you? You're welcome. Please sit down. How are you? Uh-uh. Sit down, sit down. Hi. Mama, how are you? You look well. Thank you. you well. <laughs> Nature has been long. Hmm. I've been missing you honestly. Mama, I know. You see, my father my father is just too strict. He doesn't allow me to go out again. Why? What happened? He doesn't allow me to go anywhere. Just because he wants me to marry one of his son's friend, who is a senator. And I said no. What? <laughs> Why did you say that? No. Why? Because I don't love him. Ha. I don't love him. Princess, oh. <laughs> me, I don't know. One thing I know for a fact is that your father loves you. And whatever he's doing right now is for your best interest. Why don't you listen to him? But I already have someone that I love. I love a man. Someone, someone, someone that will give me happiness. <coughs> the man after my heart. The man that gives me happiness. Yes, my daughter. You are right. Sometimes people don't understand that a happy home is all about good husband. Um, Chilu, Chilu, Chilu. Princess, I want to ask you this question. I'm sorry, you. I know you might think I'm sounding like your father right now, but what are you doing with a commoner? A common, ordinary village hairdresser? I mean, is that the best choice of a husband? Listen, oh, as for me, oh, I will say, listen to your father. Take his advice. Marry the senator's son. That marriage will have guarantee. Your future will be secure. There's a future there. See, but you see, with that hairdresser, there's no future at all. See, now you don't understand. Okay. 
I need Odima. someone that would love me. I need someone that would respect me. Someone that would give me happiness. Someone that would make me happy. That is what I want from a man that I would call my husband. Well done. And you think you can get all of these things from that common, ordinary village hairdresser? Eh? Of all the men in this Tina. world. Tina, Tina, just stop. Please. Ordinary village hairdresser. Stop! Stop, Villa... it's stop okay. it. It's alright. I don't like this. It's okay. Oh. Look, I, 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 I came here to see you people mm -hmm. and also to see Mama. Oh, dear. Mm -hmm. And Mama, I'm happy that you're fine. Thank you. You're fine, right? I'm fine. That's my happiness. Wow. Thank you. Oh. Thank you. Um, well, okay. okay. Um, <laughs> well, I wasn't able to buy anything, but Mama, this is fine. All the time. You are still on me to do something when you come here. Of course, Mama. Hey, but it's oh. not a must. Yes, Mama, I have to. <laughs> I have to. What I have to. What to. Be 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 okay, my sister. Yeah. Yeah. God bless you. Oh. I have to go before my father notices. Yeah. Chai. Thanks I'm for coming, okay? Tina. Mm -hmm. I would have seen you off, but let me just say, um, there's something I'm sorting out with Mama. Uh, nice. So I'll see you later, oh. Uh -huh. Thank you. Bye-bye, oh. Chai. Okay. <laughs> Chai. Mm -hmm. Chai. Mm -hmm. Chai. Mm -hmm. Why did you like this? Mama, please, oh, I don't want her to move. Please, please, this is my marriage thing. I say I want everything. Osh, 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 osh. I don't want to announce myself oh, because I don't know my enemies. You think it's everybody that will be happy for me? Look at this. Look at the nice things I got. You think it's everybody that will celebrate it? You don't know that in this life you have to, you have to be very smart. See, ha. Me, see, you care. see, Mama Biko, let's talk about my joke. No, let's talk about my Ankara. <laughs> then, then, Mama, this one is going to be my first appearance as a bride. <laughs> you see this one, eh? <laughs> Mama, you don't want to know. This one is one. Maybe, I don't know, Mama, is it this one for the second or this one? Which one do you like? Choose now. Mama, is it this one or... Mama? Mama, what is the matter now? What is wrong with you? Are you not happy for me? I am happy for you, but I'm not happy. Eh? Mama, why the now? You are treating princess like Mama. Mama, why now? I'm not happy the way you are treating your friend. That girl is so good to, the, to this family. Can you be treated? You are supposed to show her this is. Mama, don't worry, I'll choose for myself. I sent for you. Yes. I said, let me talk with you in the presence of your mother here. To look at this issue again. I love you as a father. I want your well-being. I want your happiness. I want your love. I look to the future and I want the future to be well and good and healthy for you. Mama, leave that boy. There is no road there. That road is full of rohi, 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 rohi. And that road ends at a deadlock. Come out from there. Marry my friend Sam. That's where you belong. That's where your class belongs. Eh? It's okay, Dad. Do you want to go to America and stay? You want to stay in Britain? Go, you are free! 
or you name any country. Father, can I ask you a question? Hmm. Father, ever since I've been born, have I disobeyed you? I am not your only child. My brother Obiora lives with his family abroad and they live happily. You live with my mother and you bought her happy. So why can't you let me find my own happiness? I mean your so-called senator's son is not going to give me the happiness that I want. You cannot find happiness there. Happiness does not reside in squalor. No. Ah, ah. Can there be any Kudoku happiness ever? Is it not this boy that makes it? Is it not this boy that uses his, his ten fingers to fat a Siamese mother? Is it not that boy? How can you find happiness there, my, my daughter? No. But father, he loves me. He loves and he respects me. That is what happiness is all about. You better listen to your father's advice. Are you listening to me? Hey, look here. I will support your father in every step he takes concerning this issue. How can you find happiness? I wonder. In, in where? In the happiness that in squalor. Ah, you can't find happiness amongst a missed squalor. Let me tell you. For the last time, if you like, listen. If you don't like, it will enter in one ear and exit through the other ear. Because all the terrible. Okute and our one million. Happiness. Happiness can only be found with wealth. Only you have is when you have fed, fed yourself, is when you have eaten, is when you are filled, is when you do not have worries about eating about your daily bread that's when you can begin to think of other things to do that's when you are happy i have made up my mind and i your daughter have decided to marry the low class guy the hairdresser the classless boy i have decided to marry him and you as my parents if you both love me as your daughter, all I need from you is your support, your blessings. Hey! Now you keep quiet. You better leave that Salim boy alone. Make another choice. I am not making another Make choice. Make another choice. No, mom. Shut Shut up. Up. I want you to send for that boy. That boy? Father, who's that boy? The hairdresser. The boy that wants to marry you. Father, why the sudden change of mind? I hope all is well. All is well. I want to make him happy. You want to make him happy? 
Does that mean you have finally agreed for Chuma and I to get married? <laughs> okay, you know what? First thing tomorrow morning, I will send for him. I will send for him. First thing tomorrow morning. First thing tomorrow morning, he'll be here. He'll be at the palace. <laughs> I don't understand. Did you say your father asked you to call me? Eh? That he wants to make me happy? Because I don't understand this sudden invitation. I know you'll be surprised, okay? But my father said he wants to make you happy. He wants to make me happy? Wait. Has he accepted for me to marry you? Because that's the only thing he can do to make me happy. Just say something. <laughs> He just wants to see you. He wants to see me. Mm -hmm. Okay, so should we go? Should we go? She has a good heart. Okay, I'm ready to go. Should we go? Mm -hmm. No matter what in this life, no matter the condition, she can't change her at all. Princess Dima, a very simple girl. You might have seen. Thanks. Thank you, Owen. Ah, Dima. Yes, father. Go get something for, for him. Drinks. No, no, no. Your Majesty, I'm fine. I'm good. Everybody's dead. Drinks? No, no, no. I'm fine, Your Majesty. Thank you. Alright. Alright. Alright, sit down then. Oh, thank you. Um, Dima. Yes, father. I have something to discuss with the young man, so. If you just excuse us, okay? Yes. Ah. Ah. Yes, Chuma, right? That's the name. Chukuma. Oh, Chukuma. Yes. Oh. Yes. That's the full name. Yes, Your Majesty. Good. Beautiful. So, how is business? Business is fine, Your Majesty. Yes. Um, Chuma. There comes a time in the life of a man when a man meets his chief face to face. That translates to meeting one's good luck. understand? Yes, sir. Yes. So, I want to believe that today you are meeting your chief face to face. You're meeting good luck. The good luck that happens once in one's lifetime. Thank you, sir. <laughs> Thank you, Your Majesty. Thank you very much. Yes. This meeting today is remarkable in the sense that it is going to be a turning point in your life. <laughs> Thank you, my king. <laughs> Thank you, your majesty. <laughs> Do you know that my son, Obiora, lives in the UK? Yes, he lives in the UK with his family and he's completely settled. Mm. He doesn't ask for from me. Instead, he even sends money home. You know? That's how rich he has become. I'm very happy for him. The money. And do you know that that is what every young man should be looking up to? Yes. yes. You know? That is being abroad, having everything at your disposal. That's what you should be aiming at. <laughs> yes. 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 In here is ten million naira in cash, and 
Ten million is not something you pluck from the sky. Ten million. Before you get ten million, you have to work for it. At least you're doing business and you know that making a hundred thousand naira only is an uphill task, right? Yes, the million. <laughs> It. 10 million naira. And this 10 million is for you. For me? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> this 10 million naira is for you. <clears throat> yes. So what it means is that as you're leaving now, you just Pick this 10 million naira and walk away. <laughs> Thank you so much, Your Majesty. 10 million naira for me. Thank you so much. May, may, may God bless you. Yes. May the gods bless you. Yes. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you so much. <laughs> so, the, yes. <laughs> the princess will be very glad to hear this. <laughs> yes, yes. <laughs> you see, 10 million naira does not come without a fee. You have to work for it. At least you should ask yourself in your mind's eye, you know, God has given you some brain that before you get 10 million, you will have to pay a little price. So there is just a little price for this. But at the end of the day, you just walk away with this 10 million. So what is going to happen is As soon as we are done here, and there is nothing we are doing really, all it requires is yes from you. You pick this money and you walk away quietly. You do not tell any other person, not even my daughter. You don't tell her you have left. You just take the 10 million, walk away from the palace, Enter a taxi, leave town, leave your house. How much do you have in that house? It's not worth anything. Ten million. So you leave my daughter alone. That's the price. This is called settlement money. Yes. <laughs> Your Majesty. Yes. I'm very sorry to disappoint you. My love for your daughter can't be bought with money. I can't take the money, I'm sorry. No. No. You have to think about this now. No, sir. No, sir, I can't take the money. I'm sorry. Sir. I, I can't take this 10 million. Yes, sir. I'm sorry, sir. I'm sorry, Your Majesty. That's your answer. Yes, sir. That's your answer. Yes, sir. You cannot take the money and walk away and leave my daughter alone. Sir. Is that what you are telling me? Sir, I love your daughter so much, sir. Come on, stop that love thing. I'm saying take the 10 million. Forget love. There is nothing like love. Walk away and become rich. Sir, I, I, my love your daughter can't... 20 million. Sir? 20 million. I'm sorry, sir. I can't, I can't take the money, sir. That all. I'm sorry, sir. That's all you have to tell me here. Yes, now get up and get out. Sir. Now you get out. Out! Go out there. Out! Out! out. What, what is it? 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 The fool has left. The fool has left. The common who has left, the royal who has left, hey, you come back here, come back here, and come back. We're giving 10 million naira, 10 million naira. Oh, I see. Sorry for what happened. I'm so sorry. Your father offered me 10 million naira to stay away from you. He wants me to take the money and go abroad. 
thank you for not accepting the offer. Thank you. This shows how much you love me. It shows that you're willing to do anything for our love. I strongly believe in you. I know what to do. I have to go. That's fine. I'll come over to your house, okay? I wonder why your father Igwe is, is like that. Huh? Why is he doing that? Trying to sell her to his daughter. To that useless Slater uh, son. Huh? Without even asking if his daughter will be, will be happy in that marriage. What kind of nonsense is that? Oh, I huh? don't know. I don't know. I'm just happy that you understand this whole thing. I don't know why my father is doing this. I don't know why. At times I wish you were the Igwe of this community. I mean, things would have been easier for the people of this community, both the rich and the poor. No, 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 my daughter, don't talk like that. Eh? Your father becoming the Igwe is not by accident. Eh? It is his inheritance. Eh? And nobody can take it away from him. Eh? But don't worry, I know what to do. I think I'll go and talk to him. Go, please. Please help me talk to my father. Help me talk to him. Don't worry, I'll go and talk to him. But you, ma, you cost it. Ah, you cost it. Uncle, how did I cost it? You should have collected that 10 million naira and located to the city with the, with the princess and start a new life. Huh? Huh? I thought you are wise. But don't worry, the mistake has been done. But like I said, I will handle it. I will handle Thank it. Thank you, Uncle. Uncle, I'm counting on you. It's okay. But Uncle, you said I should have run away with the money. You should have done that. 10 million naira is not 10 naira. At this time, we should have located, even located abroad and move on with your life. Huh? I know some people that traveled abroad with just one million naira, two million, this one, ten million naira. I, I, I thought we are wise. Um, Ikenga, I am here to discuss a very important issue with you. But I would like to start with some questions. Yes. <laughs> hey, questions, questions. Here we like to start with questions. What the matter? One, ask. You can let me ask you. Before you got married to that your lovely wife, what business were you doing, and how much did you have in your account then? Tell me. Seriously. Huh? This is this is a melodrama of a sort. How much did I have in my answer the question? How much did you have in your account then? How do you um uh, before I married? Before I brought in my wife, yes, I wasn't doing any particularly strong business. Yes, yes. Yes, and come to think of it, hey, Mukina, Mukina, Mukina too. Yes, a man adds an inch every day, every minute. You know that I didn't have more than seventy thousand in my bank account. Seventy thousand. Yes. So you still remember all these things? Yes, I do. Ah. Now tell me, why are you frustrating the man from getting married to the man? Uh, 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 <laughs> she loved. Simply because the boy is poor. 
Eh? If you know what we are doing, you 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 would have left this 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 student to get married. Let me ask you, why do you hate poor people? Why you don't want to set your eyes on them? The man has been telling me how you have been frustrating her husband to be simply because the boy is poor. To the extent you called the boy and gave him 10 million naira to leave the man alone. Why? He can't go why? If this your lovely wife rejected you there because you were poor, how would you feel? What would you do? So this is what all this is all about. So it's because of this you entered my house, right? Gossip! Gossip! At your age! Gossiping with what and how I, I as a man, a family man for that matter, Protect my own. Protect my family. Protection. What kind of protection uh, 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 is that? That you are frustrating the man from marrying uh, the, man, the, 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 boy, the boy she loves. Eh? Now let me tell you. If you continue with this, your stubbornness. If you continue with this, your attitude. I will have no option than to gather all the elders. All the kids men and give out the mass hand in marriage, let that heaven fall. You know me. You know how we do that. And nothing will happen. You will? Yes, and you know that. You will. You will do that. I am waiting for the day. I am waiting for that day. That will be the day. Ikenga, change. Change your bad character. Change your bad behavior. Change your attitude. Because if you don't, you had me. I'll have no option that to give up the man and the madness to that boy. Around my princess. Do you know if they traveled? Does it mean that they do not care? Because everybody in this kingdom knows that you and Tina are best of friends. Tell me what. I mean, is there a problem? Because I've been calling Tina's number and it's saying switched off. I hope they haven't gotten into any trouble. Please How possible can that be? Because Tina, as I'm talking to you, is married and she has moved into her. Her husband has with her mother. I don't understand you. What do you mean by Tina is married? How can she get married without telling me? And the mother didn't even tell me anything. How can she not get married without informing me? This is. So your best friend did not tell you that she was getting married. Even her brother is Zuna. You don't even attend the wedding at all. How can Tina be married? A dream of what? Hey. How can Tina be married without telling me? And you mean they no longer stay here? They are no more living here. My princess, I was going somewhere before I saw you. Let me come and help you. Have I offended them? How can Tina get married without? Without telling me. How possible can that be? To see how, how could you? How could you do this? Why did you keep this away from me? I thought we are all friends. Even if Tina would not tell me about her marriage, why did you hide this from me? I mean, what have I done to the both of you for, for you all to do this to me? Why? 
princess just calm down. Calm down. I did not attend the wedding. Yeah, because Tina did not invite me. I was even surprised. Wait, wait, wait. I, are you saying Tina did not invite you to her wedding? Tina did not invite me to her wedding. Why? Uh, no, 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 no. No, I don't. I don't want to believe that. I don't want to believe it. I was going somewhere when a car stopped in front of me. And it was Charles. I was very surprised asking him when he came back. He said it was two weeks ago. He was even surprised Tina did not tell me, even about their marriage. Later, he just dashed me money. A few hours later, Tina barged into my house, accusing me of trying to snatch her man. Wait, are you. Tina did that? Yeah. So, so why didn't you tell me anything? Why didn't you tell me? If Tina wanted you to attend her wedding, she will invite you. Please forget about Tina. And let's say something else. Okay? I have to be on my way. Are you sure? You know, if anyone had told me Tina and her mother would do this to me, I would never believe them. My love, some human beings are terrible. Not everyone who pretends to be your friend is your friend. After everything I've done for them? I suggest we forget about this matter and focus on more important things. That, that reminds me. I've been thinking. Do we tell your uncle about my intention? I mean, let's tell him I want to get married to you. I'm just afraid. I don't know what your father's reaction would be. What reaction? Tell me. Is he going to kill you because you want to marry his daughter? Hmm? Not to worry. I'll talk to my uncle. And I guess something will be done. Okay. But there is something I want you to do for me on that day. Do for you? Mm -hmm. What could that be? I want you to pay my bride price. So that traditionally I will be your wife. And you, my husband. I'll do anything for you. Thank you, my love. <laughs> I love you. And I love you too. <laughs> Do you hear your majesty? What's the matter? You don't look happy. Your daughter, I have not seen her. Where is she? Oh, I saw her going out a few hours ago. And you allowed her. What could I have done, Your Majesty? I mean, I should have held her back on her west for her not to go out. You should have known how stubborn your daughter is. Where are you coming from, young lady? Good day, mother. Good day, father. I'm going to see a friend. Which friend is that? The one you know. Which one? The love of my life. Come here! I hope it's not that riffraff of a boy. One age in Ulakaneli, a fat or simmadis, Mokibia. No more. I'm glad you know. Excuse me. Come on, come back here. 
Princess! Princess! Your daughter. Hold on, Your Majesty. Princess! My son. Uh -huh. I'm worried though. Worried about? <laughs> I was inside and overheard you discussing with the princess how you are going to go to the palace to go and marry her. Eh? Mama, what is wrong with that? Everything is wrong with that. Everything. I'm not comfortable with that arrangement. Eh? Why can't you just forget about that girl? Eh? And look for another girl in this community. There are many girls eh, you can get married to. Ah! Because, hmm, my son, the one I'm seeing too, so, hmm, I smell trouble. Trouble. I smell trouble. Besides, I, I, I want to ask you a question. If you get married to that girl, where are you going to stay with her? Is it in this little house your late father built? Is that where two of you are going to stay? I thought that by now you would have been talking about how to build your own house, even if it is just one room. Eh? Instead of thinking about getting married to one princess I don't know. Ah! Mama? Hmm? You have a point. Mm -hmm. You're right. There are other women in this community I can get married to. But Mama, the truth is, I love the princess. She loves me too. We are ready to get married to each other and I don't see anything wrong with that. Besides, I don't understand why everyone is confusing me about this house. Huh? My father told me he built this house. Yes. My uncle is saying he built the house. I am confused. But what I know, what I'm sure of is when the right time comes, God will provide money so I can build my own. Please. Hmm. Stop worrying yourself. Officer, that's the criminal. Lady the boy here back. Arrest him. Arrest him. Hey, Mr. Man, you're under arrest. Under arrest for what? When you get to the station, you find out. Oh, 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 no, 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 officer. My son has not done anything. When you get to the station, you find out. Wait, wait, wait. When did it become a crime to marry someone you love? Mr. Ma, when you get to the station, you find out. I hope the police have him in cell yet, right? Yes, Your Majesty. Beautiful. Beautiful. I'll call the DPO and discuss with him. I hope he rots in jail. Oh no, Your Majesty, please. Let him not rot in jail. I do not want anything to happen to that boy. At least let him be in police custody three to four days. When he comes out, fear will not allow him to come close to our daughter. Please. Even if he dies in there, it's not my business. It's money. Money speaks volumes. Put money here, put money there. That's right. And the case is closed. Oh, you cannot bribe God. Igwe! 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 Please, Igwe! Please forgive my son! Please, Igwe, forgive my son! Eh? Whatever he has done to you, please! Forgive him! Tell the police to release my son, please! Igwe, he's the only one! The only one! The only one I have in this world! Igwe, Igwe! He's the only one I have in this world! Woman. <laughs> Woman, 
woman. So you had the effrontery to walk through my gates, open your mouth wide after what you and your son did. Right? Imagine turning my daughter against me, against her mother, the queen. My daughter does not, does not listen to me any longer because of you and your son. Ibe, Ibe, Your Majesty, please. What does this mean to me? My son and my son and I do not. We didn't do anything. Anything. We didn't do anything to your daughter. Please, Ibe. We did nothing. We did nothing to your daughter. Ibe, please. Help my son. Never mind. I will so deal with both of you, particularly your son. I will deal with him so, so much that he will think twice before he goes anywhere near my daughter. Guts, pick up this woman. Hey. Take her out directly under the harsh sun. Hey. Let her face up. Beat the hell out of her. Hey. Come on. Move Hey, they are done with him. He will think twice before he ever gets anywhere near you. You mean you arrested Chuma? And now you beat up this old woman? Why are you so weak and what did she do? And mother, you're just standing there. You can't even talk to father. Look at what father did to this woman. Mother, please, please wake up. Wake up. Please get up. Someone help me. Please get up, get up, get up. Please don't do this to me. Don't do this to me. Uh, you have taken Guma to the hospital. Yes, yes, oh God, I've, I've uh, done that. That's so what we do. Uh, we have to go to the police station to bear the boy at home. Uh -huh. We can then go to the hospital. Go to the hospital. Uh, My mother is lying lifeless. What have we done to your father? Look at my mother is lying down lifeless. He asked his guards to beat her up. What have we done? My father will pay for it. I will expose him to the whole world. If anything happens to my mother in law, he must surely pay for it. Um, princess, don't talk like that. Hmm? Nothing will happen to her. Chuma, don't worry, your mother will be fine. Hmm? Mama? Mama? Are you awake? Mama, you're in the hospital. You're in the hospital. Mama, I'm here. I'm here. Is that you? I'm here, Mama. Uh, where is Princess? Mama, she's I'm here. here. I'm right here. I'm, uh, uh, I'm right here, Mama. I'm right here. Yes, Mama. Oh, thank you. Mama, I'm here. Are you okay? Oh, Princess.
Beau toffle. Oui, non, c'est du chardin. Elle est ma maman. Tout pour sa son. Elle est ma riche. Oui, livre de liberté. Je vais essayer la soude. Il m'a donné un mot à une petite. Des fruits en travers. On va soude. Il m'a donné un mot. Et j'arrive à un tir. Maman. 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 So, because you're my brother, you will also pour mud on my name. Can't you have respect for royalty? Respect? Ikega, did they hear you say respect? Let me ask you, why are you so wicked and heartless? Huh? Ikega, what are you talking? What has that innocent woman done to you? Which woman? Philomena. That woman you locked up her son at the police station. And when she came here to play with you to release her son, you refused. Rather, you ordered all this nonsense, all these stupid, all these good lumps you, 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 you have in your, in your palace to beat her up. Okay? Well, well, it had to be so. So that she and her son will leave my daughter alone. And you think by doing that will solve the problem? Well, I don't see any of them disturbing my daughter again. Well, as it is now, you can go to the hospital, carry her corpse, use it to prepare the soup for suya because that innocent woman is dead. I beg your pardon. What is going on here? What did I hear you say? No, no. This your husband here has committed murder. Both of you have killed a innocent woman. Simply because her son wants to marry your, son, your daughter. And let me tell you for information. Your daughter then man has gone to the police station to report the matter. So get ready to face the law. And I will also help her to spread the news to the whole community. My work is with more an innocent woman simply because I'm not sure. What did you say? You had that me, princess did what? You had me. Ikenga. Ikenga. Rakiji. It is a boy, I am mad. I cannot try no more. No more try no more. No, 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 Simply because now we are working to learn no more. You want to know where they go? You want to know where they go? It's a bad law. And let me tell you, I will help the person to spread the news to the whole community. Can I make a bad man? Come on, I'm with you. Let me tell you, we will not walk away. Get up, come here. Now, I call the police. I will never let them come. Come here, come here. What are we going to do? Your Majesty, what do we do now? Madam, hey, Princess. I'll go talk to her. Demma. Demma.
Father has used his money to shut everyone up. How do you mean? The DPO came to our house yesterday. After I reported the issue to him. And I trust my father. I know what he can do. The following morning I went to the station to see the DPO. And he told me to forget about the case. That is not wise for me to fight, to fight my own father. It was then I knew something was wrong. So your father killed my mother because he is rich and influential? Don't worry. I will make sure my father faced the law. He must pay for what he did. He won't go scot-free. I suggest you let it go. Leave him to God. Because you don't have what it takes to fight your father. Your father is very rich and influential. He can bribe the police and the judge to his side. And there's nothing you can do. So what are you saying? We should let my father go scot-free without doing anything? There's nothing you can do. You can't fight him. I suggest we let everything be. Let God judge him. Right now, I want to focus on my mother's funeral. Just like that. There's nothing you can do. Um, Chuma, Uncle, what do you intend to do? Because uh, as it is now, I'm about to gather all the police men and tell them exactly what happened. Uh, Uncle, no, there's no point. There's no need for that. Uncle, because if I pursue this case from now till five years to come, my mother will not wake up from the land of the dead. Please. My only concern is how to bury my mother and move on with life. May God, let, let, let God judge the Igwe. Yeah. Yes, uncle. It's okay. You have a point. You have a point. So, where do you intend to bury your mother? Uncle, I'll let you know when the time comes. <laughs> it's okay. Uh, in case if you need anything, don't hesitate to let me know. Let me see where yeah, I can be of help. Hmm? Thank you, Uncle. I have to be on my way. Thank hmm? you. Like I said, if you need anything, just let me know. Okay, Uncle. You shall do something. <laughs> Challenges you may face, to seek any well over. She has a good heart, she has a good heart. I will let you up here. I will let you up here. I will let you up here. She has a good heart, she has a good heart. No matter what in this life, she Princess Dima, a very simple girl. 
Mr. Chenga, since we have waited for you out there to come and perform your duty in uh, our daughter princess marriage, as a the father and the Igwe, you refuse to come. So I, your brother, uh, have done what you're supposed to do because we are the same family. And uh, as it is, our in-laws, they have gone home with our daughter. So this envelope here contains 20,000 naira. The bride price, our son-in-law, Chuma, paid on our daughter's head, the ma. This is it. And uh, this one contains 5,000 naira. For, by the way, where is Lolo? Anyway, uh, even if she's not here and they receive it, the same thing. This is 5,000 naira. Ego Kenne. The same our son in law brought this one for Ego Kenne. So, look at it. You know, like I told you some time ago, that if you don't allow the man to marry the man he loves, I will have no option than to gather all our case men and all the cabinet members and give out to them as hand in marriage. Uh -huh. That is exactly what I have done. I hope uh, I have spoken, I have said it all. That is correct. Uh -huh. So, I am for your information. Demma is not married and she is not living with her husband. So, no more of your frustration, intimidation or whatever. Uh -huh. This one you are calling my name can't this time. Okay. You are my jack and ampara. Eru ma kananjo. However, you you were ever able to do that because you are my nearest relative alive, the only brother alive. That gives you the right to do what you just did. See that money? I will not touch it. Hmm? I am not going to touch that money. Hmm. Yes. Hmm. Of course, you are my witness. He said he's not going to touch this money. That I should go with it. You are my witness, so. You are my witness, so. Yes. What the man? You have touched the money. You have touched the money. You have touched the money. Thank you for dashing me this money. God bless you. Let's go. Have you called to know how she is faring? Called? Yes. Mom, I'm not calling anybody. I am not calling anybody. I mean, why? Why should I call her? Please, though, nobody should stress me. As a matter of fact, eh, she cannot even reach me because I changed my line. I do not want to be in contact with anybody in my past. Especially her. And you know why? Please, don't stress me. Oh. Yes, I changed my line. She can't reach me even if she wants to. And I'm not going to call her. Uh-uh. I've even deleted her number, so I don't even have it in my head. Uh, what of the uh, uh, poor hairdresser boy? Have you seen him to know whether they have gotten married? Mama, which one is my... I mean, what is my business? Am I the father and the mother of this person we are talking about? Mama, what is my own in this matter? See, I don't have, I don't have strength. Oh. I am a nursing mother. All I need now is just to rest. here all alone, thinking. Hmm? What is it? 
I am disturbed. Over what? What's bothering you? I have done everything required. Traditionally. I have paid your bride price. You are not my wife. But I'm worried. We're here to do our, our white wedding. Your parents are not in support. They don't like me. Besides, who's going to hand you over to me? Who's going to hand you over to the priest? We don't even have money to sponsor our wedding. What do we do? Don't worry. Don't worry about that. I'll find someone and I'll look for money. Anything. God will provide, okay? I'll think of something to do. You need to stop worrying. Please. It's okay. Are you sure you stopped worrying? Princess, this is incredible. Are you sure of what you're telling me? Because I can't believe your father the king can do such a thing to you. Father, I cannot lie to you. How will I came by lying against my own father? My father locked up my shop for a very long time now. He even arrested my husband just because I, 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 I help people and because I accepted to marry the man that I love. And the only offense my husband committed is because he is poor. You can believe this. Your father do such a thing to you. You can believe this. Okay. So what do you want me to do? Father, my husband and I are planning to get married. Good. But just that the problem is I don't know where he stands for me as my father. Because I know that's the last thing my father would want to do. And I know if he refuses, he might not agree to wed us. You're right. I will make our time and see your father. Okay. I'll try to talk to him. Please, please, please. But please. if by first strength he refused, then I will not support him. I will know what to do. Okay. Just don't worry, I'll get back to you. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. So for that. Right. I have to be on my way. I'll get back to you. Okay. Your Majesty, you have to do something. These children are in love. They've been together for a very long time. And you know love is the most important thing in every marriage. Money or no money. I'll be so glad if you support them as a father and as the king, as the king of this kingdom. These children are living together. As husband and wife. Yes, what else do you want me to do? You know they are preparing for their marriage. And that is where they need your support most. Not interested. I am not. Nothing in this life will make me hand my daughter over to you in church. That would be the last thing I would do. But your Majesty, I was busy upstairs. I'd like to go up and finish what I was doing. If there is any other thing you want us to talk about, I am game. Or maybe. You want me to give money to the church? I will do that now. I'm fine, Your Majesty. I don't need any money. The church is fine. You see? The church does 
does not need money. That's all right. Okay, so if you will excuse me, I will go up. It's all right, it's no problem. I have to be on my way. My friends, please. Now is the time that I need your help. I need your help. Chuma and I are planning our wedding. And I need some money. Any amount. I just need you both to borrow me some money so that we could use it to plan our wedding. And I, I promise to pay back. I promise to pay you back. Princess, you don't need to tell me all these stories because I knew it all. You see, I'm going to support you both with my three month salary, okay? Tessie, yeah? your three month salary? I will do that for you. Thank you so much. God bless you. Thank you. Thank you so, so much. I'm grateful. You don't know what you've done for okay. me. Thank you so much. And I'm going to support you with 50,000 naira. 50,000 naira? Thank you so much. It's okay. You guys, it's okay. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. Thank you so much. The wedding is already done. I promise I will pay you back. And what you both have done for me, I will never forget it. I will never forget you people. We Any are day, anytime, and forever, I won't forget. It's okay. Thank you. And one more thing. I'm going to be your cheapest maid. <laughs> How do you think? <laughs> That's not a problem. You are officially my chief bridesmaid. And I am going to be there. Of course. Don't so bother happy. about my clothes. I'll handle it. You're welcome. It's I'm confirmed. Welcome. <laughs> Thank you so much. <laughs> nice what are you doing here? This is my father's house. Or well, am I not allowed to come to my father's house again? Dima. So this is how you chose to destroy your life. Does it mean you cannot change your mind? Hmm? Over what? What do you mean over what? I'm asking you. Over that good for nothing, wretched, ordinary hairdresser boy. That's what I'm talking about. Well, mom, that is not possible. Really? Yes. Well, this is my invitation card. And as my parents, you both are invited. Yeah. You are mad. You are indeed a mad girl. Yes. I am mad. That's because I am madly in love with him. And I cannot do without him. Did you hear that, your majesty? Did you hear what this girl is saying? Wedding card. Wedding card. Oh. Oh, no! Give me! See! See, ordinary paper. See wedding card. A princess like you. Tell me. How many governors, senators, how many traditional rulers will attend that, that wedding? How many? Well, Dad, I did not invite any of them. Because my husband and I do not have the money to entertain them. Of course you do not have money. But they are your friends, Dad. And you have the money. So why not invite them? It's your daughter's wedding. change your mind from this. 
You can change your mind from this and leave that gold digger. Well, I don't see that happening, Mom. And this will be the last time I will set feet in this house. So, where did you say your wife went to again? <sighs> she went to give her parents a wedding invitation. Hmm. But from what you told me just now, are you sure they will accept the invitation? Well, I'm not sure. I'm honestly not sure, but I told her to try her luck. You know what? Her friends really surprised me. Really? Yes. What did they do? You won't believe this. One of her friends gave us her three months salary wow. to support her wedding. The other one gave us 50,000 naira to support her wedding. Wow. They really tried though. Yes, they have. Hmm. That's good. That reminds me, I was going to ask you. Okay. What we discussed, how far? Oh, don't worry about that. Hmm? Um, I'll be your best man and I will also buy my suit and my shoe myself. Thank you. You're welcome, my brother. Thank you very much. Hey. Debut. I need a favor from you. There is not going to be any wedding. Because that wedding will not hold. I don't want that wedding. Libio, I want you to storm the church on that day with your men. Arrest everybody, including the Reverend Father, and lock all of them up. Name your fee, and I'll pay you. Your Majesty, that will be possible. It will not be possible. What exactly are you talking about? Let me ask you, Your Majesty, what is this boy's offense? First, you locked him up in a police cell. Secondly, you killed his mother. It was because I intervened that you were not messed up. And now you are asking me, Your Majesty, to send my men to the church and stop the wedding. Even arresting everybody there, including the Reverend Father, the man of God. Your Majesty, where is your conscience? Yes, where is your conscience? I just want to let you understand this. I am not part of this. I will do such nothing. Leave this boy alone. Let the couple be. Leave them alone. If you don't want to attend the wedding ceremony, leave them. Let them be alone. Let them be. Even with money or without money, let them be. And I honestly tell you, it's an advice. Don't do anything funny. Because I will not be there. I will not side you. I will only send my men there for security purposes. TPO. Why are you talking this way? Huh? Okamuna Gina by far together. We've always done things together. Come on now. It's the same money I will give you. And I said, name your fee. I will give you whatever you ask. In this case, your money can do nothing. I honestly tell you, it's damn boy. 
Your Majesty, please leave them to me. Please, I, I, I beg you to take my leave. Two hundred and sixty-eight thousand ninety naira. Two hundred and sixty-eight thousand ninety naira. Mhm. Mm mm -hmm. That's a lot of money, you. Yes. Hey. <laughs> hey. Thank God for a successful wedding. I thank God everything ah. went well, and that Reverend Father, he's really a good person. Yes, he is. He's truly a man of God. Yes, you're right. I bless God for everything. Only I've been thinking, how do we pay back our debts? Oh, that's true. Have you written the names of people? Yes, you yes. About nine of them. Huh? Nine. Emeka, Chigozi, Ikenna. My love. Huh? That means we need to take money from the money we realize so we can pay up our debts. I don't want these people to come here now and start requesting for their money. You know they did well by boring us. Huh? So we need to take money to pay up the debts. Huh? How much is. I've just been thinking. Uh, hey, this. I, I don't know. Okay. <laughs> Dima. Dima. What's wrong with you? You're vomiting. Are you sick? Are you alright? Are you sick? Dima. Are you sick? You're vomiting. <laughs> Why are you smiling? My love, I'm not sick. You're not sick? So, what's wrong with you? I'm pregnant. You're pregnant? How did you know that? <laughs> Are you a doctor or a nurse? Because I'm a woman. Eh. Yes. We have to go to the hospital to confirm. Honey, we don't need to go to the hospital. I'm pregnant. But, but if you insist, we go to the hospital. <laughs>
了。Pointing fingers at my shop. I waited a while to to see what they were up to. Dima, there's something wrong somewhere. They have a mission, and my neighbor told me that the same people came looking for me yesterday, and they were pointing fingers at my shop. Yes, they have a mission, and I don't think they are genuine. Why would my father send bad boys to kill you? I don't know. My point exactly. We didn't do anything wrong. That's my point. I think I should go and confront him. No, 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 no. What? No, no, you don't have to do that. Oh, so, so what do you want us to do? Should I just let them kill you? Listen, let's leave this village. Let's run off to a neighboring community. Yes. Leave this village? Yes. Why should we run away from our own village? I mean, what happens to your shop? See, that's the best thing to do now. Let's save our lives first. The shop, we can do something about it later. But we need to run off and... Listen, we have some money, right? At least we can rent a small house and hide for now. That's the best thing we can do. What did we do to deserve this? Why? What did we do to deserve this? Is it a crime to marry someone that I love? Just because he's poor? Why? God help us. Dima. God help us. We have to leave. Listen to me, we have this is not the time to cry. Okay? We need to leave this village right now. Staying in this village is risking our lives. Please. Please. Do you understand me? Staying in this village will be risking our lives. I Let's run off to a neighboring community and hide for now, please. Mm. Mm. My dear, I'm so sorry. I'm sorry all this while you're calling your phone. You know, this is our work. We don't normally have to. At all. From Monday mm. to Friday. Saturday lesson. Sunday, church and other things. You know now. I'm so sorry. My friend, I understand. Eh? And I'm not angry with you. I can't be angry with you now. I understand. I understand how your work can be. Thank you for your understanding. <laughs> That's why I like you. <laughs> yeah. mm. So, this is where you're living now. <laughs> My dear, this is where life has brought us. So this is where we live now. You can see it now. <laughs> Hey, 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 so you're pregnant? Hey, my dear, I'm happy for you. Hey, so how is your husband? Thank you, my friend. My husband is fine. Hey, as you can see, God has blessed me with pregnancy. I am pregnant, and I am a complete woman. I can see that. Oh, I just pray that those that are looking for the fruit of the womb. God will also bless them too. Amen. 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 <laughs> so tell me, how is Clara? Clara is fine, my dear. Yeah. She could have come with me, but she's not feeling fine. Yeah, yeah. she's not feeling fine. Hi. This is not serious. Hmm? No, it's not. I pray God heal her. God will heal her completely. In Jesus' name. Amen. Um, you were telling me something on phone. Mm -hmm. What makes you and your husband relocate to this place? My friend, bad boys were tracking my husband. Bad boys? They wanted to kill him. For what? what? I don't know. I don't know. You know, a few days after my wedding, mm -hmm. my husband went to the shop. 
And then he saw two bad boys. They parked their bike along the street. So they were pointing at my husband, pointing at my husband. Then they would give themselves signs. So when they noticed my husband saw them, they drove away. So yeah. One of the neighbors, one of my husband's neighbors, told my husband that those same bad boys came to the street yesterday and then they were pointing at the shop. Pointing at the shop. That was when my husband knew there was danger. So we had to run out of the village now. Because you know these bad boys. Yes, now. Once they, they, they don't find my husband in the shop, they will come to the house. I, mean, I don't want anything to happen to my husband. So we had to move on. We had to come down to this place. But to be frank, I'm suspecting my father. Your father, Kwa? Yes. You know, he was never in support of my marriage. What does he want? By now, he could have known that both of you are meant for each other. Huh? Well, to allow you both to enjoy your marriage. Well, I know that as God lives, as long as God is alive, my father will only try. But he will never succeed with his plan. He will never succeed. This is serious. <laughs> uh, look at me, I didn't even ask you. Eh? What do I offer you? I don't have food in the house, so, but even if it's not now, eh? let me go and I get I beg, food. don't bother yourself. Sit down. I don't want anything to happen to this, my baby. Are you sure? Yes, now. <laughs> Thank you. Chai. Hey. You There's no food in this house. I don't even have money. What do we do? I'm afraid he's going to die of hunger. God will provide. God will provide? That's all we keep saying. God will provide, God will provide. When is God going to provide? I'm just tired. I'm just tired of everything. Why do I have to go through this? Do you regret marrying me? Because you complain and you're lamenting. It's making me feel uncomfortable. My love, I'm, I'm sorry if I make you feel that way, but... I'm just tired. How can I be living my life like this? Huh? So how, 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 how do I provide for these boys? Am I going to let him die of hunger? Can I suggest something? What is that? Why don't you look for a job? Any kind of job, even if it's a gatman's job. When I look for something to do, anything. Since at the end of the month you will pay the salary. How much can a gatman's job possibly give us? Mm -hmm. Huh? How much? Am I am I going to take care of this boy with whatever I make from being a gateman? It doesn't make sense. I'm just tired. Oh, no, I'm just afraid. I, I hope. I hope. I, I. I don't. I don't. You no, you keep calling God every time. I, it's not like I don't believe it. I believe in God, but at this at this point, it is too much. It's too much. Eh? Very soon, he's going to start crying.
sorry, please. Can I make use of your phone? I want to send a text message to someone. I forgot mine at home. I can eat your food. What food? I'm not eating again. Just take a look at what we're eating. And my only child is dying of hunger with her little baby. God forbid. Stop chewing it like that, your majesty. I'm glad you meet. I think I know what to do. What? I'm going to look for my daughter. Or better said, I'm going to call her. So she can come over. Stop eating, stop eating that chicken like that. Come on, your majesty. I am not a princess, and my name is not Dima. Yes, ma'am. Someone used my phone to send a message, and she has left. Yes, she, she came to buy sachet milk from my store. All right, ma'am. Thank you, ma'am.
What happened? Eh? I couldn't find them, Your Majesty. I was told they ran out from the house. Ran out of the house? That's or what relocated? I can't tell. That's what they told me. That they ran out from their house. Dima, uh, I'm looking for Tina. Ah, that's my madam. Yes. But she's not around now. She went out with my father. Okay. Hey. Uh, so what about her mother? She's inside. Oh, she's inside. Of course. Please, can you help me call her? Tell her that um, Dima, the princess, princess is here. Princess? Yes. Princess, wait. Mama! Hey, hey, hey. Don't touch me, please. Mama. Mama, what are you doing here? And who showed you this place? Mama, it's me, Princess. Tina's friend. I know. I am not short of sight. And my question is still what are you doing here? Ah, please. Just leave. Mama? Mama? Are you are you saying I should I should leave this place? Do I have water in my mouth when I say this? Eh? If from me now no your wicked father. Igwa Jobi insulted my own daughter, Mbada Flores, Adanjejemba, when she came to visit you in the palace and pushed her out. Now you are here in her own house. What are you doing here? No, what brought you to this place? Oh. I thought you are mad. Eh? You should be in your husband's house by now. Why are you wandering about looking so tattered? Eh? Please, just go back to your 
wretched and poor husband's house. Enamu, let her go back. It's better you leave. Tina! What? Hi! Shh, shh, shh! Move away! Move away! What are you doing here? Huh? What are you doing in my mansion? Talk to me. What are you doing here? Tina, it's me. Me. The princess. Of course I know it's you, the princess. Of course! It's you, the princess, but I bloody don't care. I mean, what are you doing here is the question. So you go straight and answer the question. What are you doing here, princess? Mm -hmm. Do you realize it's me you're talking to? I don't get it. Do I have memory loss or am I blind? It's you, the princess, of course, and I know it's you I'm talking to. That question is directed to you and nobody else. What are you doing here? Tina. Who Tina me there? Tina what? No, 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 Tina what? Oh, you're here to add more insults to the one your father has given to me, right? That one is not enough. You're here to add. Isn't it? Princess. Why are you like this and what happened to you? I mean, who cares? Who cares? Why is that the first thing you're looking at? Why is that the first thing you're looking at? Of course you should look like this and she should cry like this as well. But you see all of these crocodile tears, this year, it's all crocodile tears. There's nothing, nothing. Bloody pretender. If I tell you what this girl did to me. Hmm? Princess. Princess. Hey. If I tell you what this girl did to me, Makachuku, you will fling her through the fence out of this compound. You see this girl who calls herself a princess standing here in front of me. She calls herself my friend. But yet, she advised me when you were not ill. That I should forget about you. I should forget about Charlie. Mm. Charlie's not the only man on earth. Besides, she has seen his future and is never going to make it. Oh yes, you told me that. And that even if my Charlie ever makes it back into this village, he's going to come out poor and wretched. As a matter of fact, this stupid girl standing right here wanted to hook me up to one village watching. Huh? One mystery. Tina. And I refused. So I said, thank God forbid I have to wait for my man. Because I know that Charlie is my man, my God ordained man. And I believe Tina. he's going to make it Tina what? If you Tina me again, if you Tina, if you death, if you, if you death Tina me again, I will change, I will change her for you. Who is talking with you? And oh. I, you're suddenly coming here to fake an apology because you now know that yes, my Charlie is back. Not only back, back bigger and better. He has made it. Now you want to come and fake apology so that you can beg for money. I have seen through you. Oh. I have seen through you. I know you. You think this is CBN? Oh, man, go inside and pluck the money now. Isn't that money you came to beg for? Go in and pluck. Go and pluck. Anyways. Nonsense. Anyways, she can see that no condition is permanent. No condition is permanent. Oh, yes. my dear. Thank God I had foresight. And I had my own senses too. Lisa. She's accusing me. I never said all those things. They are not true. Oh, I never I never oh. said all those things. She's lying against me. She's lying against this me. Girl, okay. Please. Listen to me, my friend. I trust my wife. Oh! Thank God. Thank you, Jesus, for the husband you are giving to me. The husband that believes in his wife. Thank God. Oh, my love. Oh, yes, baby. You know what? Give her this 10,000 naira for transport. I'm inside. Eh, eh, eh. 10,000 naira for transport. Who is going to give me 10,000 naira for transport? I know that it's the money you came for. But you're not going to see 10,000 naira from you. A whole 10,000 for transport. When was the last time you counted 10,000 in your life? When? See, eh? I know that your transport that brought you here. However long the journey is in this community, 500 naira. One. Receive. Eh. Hey. To and fro. Hmm? Another 500. That is 1,000. Take. Is it not transportation? Only. Because of God and because I'm a, I'm a Christian. Hmm? Are you adding more? Mama, let me just add more. You know, I'm a good woman. I'm a woman of God. I have good hearts. So because of the heart that God has given me, I'm not doing it for her, I'm doing it for myself. Because of my personal relationship with God Almighty. I'm going to add 1,000 Naira eh, for you. That is 2,000. This 1,000 is for you to owe body. Take! Hold your body and get out of this place. See, let me not see you here again. Oh. There is no more where this is coming from. This is not Central Bank of Nigeria. Look, did you see the logo? Did you see any logo of CBN here? In case you think you come and collect more, come and cry crocodile tears here and be collecting to 2,000. You are never going to step your foot into this company again. Now get out. I'll see you, sir. 
I'm talking, you are still standing. Adi Igwe. Five your way. Anyways, if you do not want to leave, there's no problem. You can enjoy the view because I know that <laughs> this is not in the league of what your father had. Okay? So enjoy the beautiful sight of my beautiful mansion. When you are done viewing and supervising, you can take a walk. And my gate man will assist you out of my gate nonsense. Don't tina me, oh. Don't tina me, dear. That, 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 don't, 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 don't tina me. That, get out. in wickedness began to be born. No condition is permanent here in this world. Don't conclude yet. You don't know tomorrow. in wickedness began to be no condition is permanent here in this world. No condition is ever permanent. No condition is permanent here in this world. My love, I, I don't understand. Are you trying to say the same girl you helped? The same girl you helped her family is the one doing this to you. And you said, because of her and I, your father locked up your shop. Human beings are unpredictable. You know, if anyone had told me that Tina and her mother would do this to me, I would never believe. In fact, I would consider that person my enemy. But look at... Why is this world so wicked? So, so wicked. My love, it's okay. Stop, stop being bothered. We're not dead. And I strongly believe we're not going to die. Everything is going to be fine. I promise you. Okay? Everything will be fine. Stop bothering yourself, please. Fine. It's well. <laughs> she needed to see the way I was humiliated, insulted. Embarrassed. <sighs> it's well. God is watching. Uh, where is Sumto? Oh, he's asleep. Oh, sh should I bring him? Wait, let me check up on him. Why would she disobey me? Well, you should have allowed this girl to marry the man of her choice. Mm? You should have allowed her. After all, she's the one to live with the man. Not you and I. Was this your position initially? But you never allowed me to say anything. Of course, you didn't allow me to talk. Hmm. And that's why he was just badging like that, with a straight face. Furious. Eh? Going to disturb my, my peace of this moment. I'm disturbing your peace? Your Majesty, I'm disturbed. All right. I'm going to call her son. I'm going to tell him everything that is happening.
God, if I've wronged anyone, let my enemies laugh at me. And let all their wish be a cause for me. But if I do not wrong anyone, Lord, let all their bad wishes turn out to be a blessing for me and my family for the rest of our lives. Izu, what's the matter? What are you doing here? I've been everywhere looking for you. Why are you facing around? Um, I've been. Are you okay? I've been bothered. Over what? Since I got back, I've not seen the princess. I've tried looking for her, but she's nowhere to be found. Is there a problem? Have you seen her? You know her whereabouts? Um, the princess. Well, you you know the princess is married now, and as a married woman, I want to believe she. She made up her mind to concentrate on family and build yeah. it. Yeah, so people, I don't know, it's been a very long time I, I last saw her. She doesn't have time for anyone, not even me, her friend. She has chosen family over friends. So, I suggest you two grow up. Alright? <laughs> Wait a minute. You mean, I'm talking about the princess, your best friend. Of course. You don't know her whereabouts. I, I don't. Now. Yes. The lion. I mean, I don't believe you. Eh? Come to think of it, you can't tell me you don't know where the princess is. That means you've not been checking up on her or you're totally avoiding her. Wait, did I just hear you say, Tina, you're lying? Like, Tina, you're lying. You're talking to me. You're looking straight into my eyes and you're calling me a liar. Right? No, I don't blame you now. So you think because you're taller than me now, we are age mates. You, 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 you seem to forget I'm, I'm way older than you. So I, your sister, is lying. Like, I, I think you're lying. Are you all right? I'm sorry. No, no, are, are you okay? It's okay. Because I play, I play and joke with you because I'm, I'm not a proud sorry. person. Because I bring myself down to your level. You I'm now sorry. think you are, you are something. Tina, you're lying. Don't you ever repeat that again. I will not tolerate that nonsense from you. Especially now that I'm married. You were doing this thing then when we we're back home, but don't try it here. Fine. What nonsense? It's okay. This boy, you don't have respect though. Sorry. All right. But I am seriously bothered and worried about the princess. Please. Okay, fine. Can you just help me with the address? I'll go look for her myself. Don't worry about this. Huh? Don't worry. I'll be totally fine. Just give me the address. I will look for her. I don't know where she lives. Tina! Why is she not bothered? Thank God, Mama. Oh, Why is God. she angry? Mama, I don't know. I, I, I was just asking about the princess. You know, ever since I got back, I've been trying to reach her, but she's not reachable. So I was asking Tina about the princess and her whereabouts. She's telling me she doesn't know. Imagine Tina, princess's best friend, telling me she doesn't know Tina's whereabouts. So I told her she's lying and she picked the fence. I even went ahead telling her to give me the address so I can go look for her myself. But she refused and I really walked out. Mama, please, do you know the princess's address or where I can find her? Anywhere, anything, because one's number or anything. Mm. I don't know. And there is nothing like problem between them. You don't have any problem. I don't know her address. And whatever she told you, is the truth. Mama, I, I never mentioned problem between them. There is a problem. Tessie, please don't be offended if I disturb you one more time. I know I disturb you a lot. But please, oh, please. This should be the last time I would, I would ask for something like this. What is it again? Is it money? How much? Any amount. Any amount. My landlord asked us to vacate the house because we can't pay house rent again. And my husband just got a job to be a gate man. Since there's a security house there, we decided to leave there. But please, when we get there, I just need more money so I can start up a small business to be able to support the family and contribute something. Try. 
No, they have not paid us in three months now. The money I have here is just a little money, 15,000 naira. I don't know if you can manage it. Ah, yes, I, I will manage it. Okay. 15,000 is enough. It's enough. I will manage it. Okay, let me get the money. Okay? Just manage it. It's okay. Stand up. Don't do this. Thank Please. You so much. Don't do this. You are really a friend. You are really a friend. Who would I have done without you? Who would I have done without you? God bless you. Thank you so much. It's okay. God bless you. Just manage it to start up something. Okay? One more thing. I want you to put everything that happened at Tina's husband's house behind you. I need to run along. You know, I left my child and you may be crying. And my husband has to go to work. So let me run along. Now. So when are you back at sea? Uh, in a few days. Okay, just give me a call. Okay. Just give me a call. So that I can visit anytime. Call for that. You're welcome. God bless you. Good day, Your Majesty. Good day, my queen. Good day. Who are you? My name is Izuna. My sister is Tina, Princess's best friend. Yes. Yeah, Tina. Where is she? I mean, I believe she will know about our daughter's whereabouts. Whereabouts? That's why I came, actually. And my sister, Tina, got married and she moved out of our house and all this while I've been in Abuja I just returned and I asked her shockingly she told me she doesn't know where uh, the princess is or her whereabouts so I thought it wise to come to the palace and um, ask you her parents believe me for the past two years we haven't seen or heard from our daughter, Princess. Two years? Two years. Do us a favor, please. Anything, Your Majesty. When you find Tina, tell her, please, to help us look for Princess and give us feedback. Okay. Please. Whenever, whenever she finds her, she should let us know immediately. I'll do just that, Your Majesty. I'll run along. Thank you. Isuna, mm. when did you come back? <laughs> you are looking good. Nice wow. to see you. Wow, when did you come back? Well, I came back last week. Wow. Yes. You're not looking bad. Oh, thank you. You're not looking bad too. Thank you. <laughs> well, I, I was having a conversation with my mother and my sister. 
they were saying something about the princess getting married and that they don't know her whereabouts. I don't know how possible that will be considering the fact that my sister and the princess are very close. I mean, that story doesn't sit well with me. Please, Desi, can you take me to the princess? Do you know anywhere I can find her? Well, I will take you to her. She's in the right position to tell everything your sister and your mother did to her. Did they hurt her that much? Please take me there, please. Don't worry, I will take you to her. Okay. Let's go. My sister and my mother did all this to you. I mean, it's crazy now. How can they do this? Mm. After everything you've done for her, for us, for my family. They could knife together mm. and lie against you before her husband. This is wickedness. Whoa. It's all right, okay. Calm down. Hmm? No, but this is wrong. Just calm down. I've forgotten about everything. Hmm? I've, I've decided to move on with my miserable life. Hmm? It's not the best thing. I don't know what I would have done. She has really helped me a lot. Really? Tessie, thank you so much. You're welcome. You're a good person. And you see for my sister and my mother. For biting the hand that fed them, God will surely judge them. You say, Tessie, how do you say anything? Don't do that now. You could have come back. They deserve to be punished, you know? Uh -uh. Of Don't talk like that. Yeah? Leave them for God to judge. Thank you. Don't talk like that now. Oh, Izuna. Mm. My husband and I will be relocating, so we will be going to where he works now. So really, he works? Yeah. Where? As what? I mean. <laughs> he works as a gate man. Yeah, the landlord of this place. He already gave us quick notice because we cannot afford house rent anymore. And we wouldn't want him to come the second time around. In this place, I so we have to leave. He, he works as a gate man. How are you going to cope with as a gate man with your child with some to be? Well, why don't you discuss with your parents? Why don't you tell them about this situation? Perhaps they could. I help. do not want to talk about my parents. Okay. Um, um. Take this. Okay. Just manage it. It's nothing. I you know, I'll be staying here for a while, and since I got back, I've not really been doing anything. My friend I'm staying with in Abuja traveled abroad, and ever since then, mm -hmm. the rent where we stay is due. And the landlord is threatening to kick us out if I don't pay. Right? So, uh, when I gather the money, I can be able to pay the landlord. Tell your brother-in-law to give you money now. Oh no, He Tessie. is rich. Come on, Tessie. Look, I intended to. When I came back, I intended to. But with this heartbreaking news, I don't intend to ask them for anything. It's wickedness. You don't have to. You don't have to. It's okay. But thank you so much. You yeah. so. Thank you. It's nothing. Thank you. Thank you. So how is Santo? He's sleeping. Sleeping inside. I regards to him. I'll come again and see him. All right, thank you. Thank you. What's the matter, Your Majesty? 
You've been standing. I think I hope nothing has happened. I hope nothing has happened to our daughter. You remember that boy? The mass friend who visited. Yes. Yes, yes. Hmm. You recall that we pleaded with them to help us mm -hmm. locate the man. Mm -hmm. well, since after them I've not seen him, not heard anything from him, not from him, not from the man. It's getting me worried. Your Majesty, did I not tell you to report this matter to the police? And up until now, you have done nothing about it. You're worried. I'm worried. Now what are we going to do about it? Now, your Majesty. Have you forgotten you're the one that drove this girl away from this house? Of course! It's alright. And whatever you're thinking, your majesty, let nothing happen to that girl. No condition is permanent in this world. No game in wickedness began to be No condition is permanent in this world. Oh, thank God. Thank you. Young man. Your Majesty. Good day. Good day, my queen. Good day. We talked with you some time ago. Oh, yes. And we pleaded with you, practically begged you to do something, do everything within your power to find our daughter. So what is the news? I came in that regard, Your Majesty. Your Majesty, there is a problem. Yes. No problem. No problem. What, what has happened to my daughter? Nothing for now, buddy. Care is not taken. Something might go wrong. <sighs> Just tell me the truth. What has happened to her? My queen, the condition I found the princess, it's very terrible. She and her husband are looking so tattered, rough, and malnourished. As a matter of fact, they can hardly feed their son even once a day. Your Majesty, the landlord where they live is threatening to push them out of the house any time from now. So I beg you, Savage the situation. See, did you actually see my daughter? Yes, you much. You saw her. Yes. Take me there now. Yes. Right away. Please. This is the particular house, a particular room she pointed to me that she lives in. The one who's fine to love. My daughter. Yes, Your Majesty. Princess lives here? Yeah? Yes, Your Majesty. <laughs> so, <laughs> please, who are you and who are you looking for? My, I am Igwe Ikenga of Agleza Kingdom. Oh, Igwe, you're welcome, Your Majesty. <laughs> you're welcome, sir. Your Majesty, I presume this must be the landlord because at the time I came, the princess told me he actually told them to park and that he's going to lock up his place. Where's your daughter lives? Yeah. Yes, Your Majesty. So where is my daughter now? You mean the lady with a kid and um, with a husband living here? The fair lady with a fair man and a kid, yes. I've jetted them. Eh? They couldn't pay their house rent. 
Well, so where are they now? I, I don't know. I wouldn't know. But what a minute, oh. A princess living in this house? Are this kind sure? of apartment? You are sure that's where my daughter lives? Oh a daughter of Igwe? This one. Mm. You want to finish the orange, eh? Mm. I don't know that. Hey. So, my love, I'm done washing, eh? Mm. So, I need to go and sell. Please, take your soap to. Eh? Mm -hmm. When he wakes up, I left small pap mm. in the flax. Mm. So, you feed him with it, eh? That's okay. Don't let him cry, oh. Go. No problem, I'll do that. My love. Please don't forget to buy some crayfish to make the okra soup when you come back. Don't forget, huh? No, I won't forget. I'll okay. buy them. Don't okay. Them. Come back on time, oh. Alright. Hmm? Alright. You see, okay? I will, I will, I will. Don't forget the crayfish, oh. job as a gate man. Mm -hmm. hmm? What happened to you? So he told me that the owner of this house mm -hmm. hmm? is around. Mm -hmm. He's around. He's around, but he's he's in town. He's in the country. Mm -hmm. You know he traveled abroad. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. You say so. I'm very excited because at least at the end of the day I'll get paid. My love that is very good. Tell me, how can someone be living in this big house? This big house. This someone be living alone without a wife. Mm -hmm. See, that's what he told me now. Mm -hmm. He said he's not married. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so I heard since he built this house, mm -hmm. he has never stayed in it. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Who knows? Now that he is back, he might start staying in the house. Mm -hmm. But you know, this house is beautiful. It's very fine. Hey! Kumaka. Recognize me? No, I, I, I don't. Princess. Utoka. Hey, Udoka! Just say God, Udoka! Hey! What's up, Chawago? 
I'm so happy. <laughs> I am really happy. But, um, You've made so much money. What I what I am yet to understand is the reason the reason why the princess of Umago Kingdom is walking on the streets. Huh? What is wrong? What happened to you? It's a long story. Long story? So how is um Lolo and the Igwe? They're fine. This is where condition has landed me and my husband. Things is very hard for us. It's been very hard. I now hawk fruit on the streets. And my husband works as a gate man somewhere. It's a joke. Tell me it's a joke. Your husband as a gatekeeper. Where? Uh, somewhere. I mean that's that's where we we, we live. We live at the security house where he works. At the security house. Has it gotten to this level? You know what? Don't worry yourself, eh? If I had to go mommy. Yeah? I've been looking, searching everywhere for you. But thank God I found you, eh? Hop in and take me to your husband. We are here. Why, why did you bring me here? This is where my husband works. I don't understand. Are you joking or what? <laughs> joking. We are my husband. This is where we live. Both of you live here? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> One does the says shall never cease. Princess, this is my house. Eh? Yes. Your house. <laughs> Udoka, this is your house. I just Are finished you? building the house not long ago and I've never slept in it for once. Chimo. This house. Where my husband works. <laughs> I mean, this house, the compound and everything in it belongs to me. You know what? Just tell your husband to open the gate. Hey! Yes, yes, I will. I will tell him all. Hey! It's me, it's me, it's me. Open the gate. Open the gate, open the gate. Open the gate now. Who's that? Who knows this house? He's the landlord. How do you know? Who's who is this? Do you know that the owner of this guy is the owner of this house? How is he the owner of this house? Do you know him before? Where did you meet him? You know, when I was hooking fruit on the street, yeah. then his car stopped. I thought it was someone that wanted to buy fruit. Yeah. To my greatest surprise, yeah. he's somebody that I know. He used to work at the palace. Someone that you know? Yeah. Are you sure this man is not a kidnapper? No! My love, I'm, I'm serious. This man is the owner of the house. Wait, did you say he, he used to work in, yes. in the palace? Let's go, let's go. Good afternoon, sir. I'm so happy to see oh, you. I'm happy to see you too. This is your husband. Oh yes, yes, this is my husband. <laughs> my good, lovely husband. Good, good afternoon, sir. Good afternoon, my dear. Sir, are you, are you the owner, owner yes, of this house? Yes, I am the owner of the house. Sir, sir I'm the gate man here. <laughs> Don't worry, let's go inside. Sir, this is my wife. Yeah, I know. <laughs> we are happily hey. married. It's alright, let's go inside. Let's go inside. Eh, uh, okay. <laughs> hey, Udoka! Udoka, this is your... So fine! Hey! Chelu, Chelu. Chelu, 
What is this? What am I saying? Wait. This is this not my husband? A, 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 a Nigerian man based in China. Charles AJK. A, a drug baron. A, a drug baron was was shot by the police. No, what is it? Why are you shouting? Mama, uh, Mama, I'll, I'll get it. Mama, I'm finished, Mama. No, 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 Mama, I'm finished, though. You are not finished. What uh, is it? Mama, look. Mama. Ah, uh, uh. Chimbo. Mama, I'm finished. Who did this? Mama, Mama. Uh, Who did this to my in-law? I'm finished, though. This is my in-law. Wait. Uh, please don't shout. Don't shout. Chimbo. Don't shout. Chimbo. Shut them. Chimbo. Chimbo. Please. Chimbo. 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 I'm finished. So after everything my parents did to my husband and I, this is where we found ourselves. I hope Fritz and my husband here works as a gift man. He had dresser before he gave one. He used to be a hairdresser. Oh yes, he, he used yeah, to be I was a hairdresser before I became a gift man. It's okay, it's okay. Well, for instance, if I told you that I have not heard this seduction story from someone else, I will be lying. But um, just that the person didn't tell me the whole story. Though I know I will see you and you will tell me everything and how it happened. I've heard from the horse's mouth and I'm so sorry for whatever that has happened to you. You don't deserve it. No? God knows the best. Okay? Thank you. Thank you. Um, Princess, <laughs> you're a good woman. Huh? And your husband here is very lucky to have you as his wife. Well, I will never forget what you did for me when your father threw me out of the palace with nothing. Not minding he was owing me four months' salary. Princess, you called me back. You gave me a huge amount of money and some words of advice which I followed. Look at me. I am rich. I have made money. I was waiting for the day of your birthday to give you a shocking surprise of your life. But with the situation of things now, I don't think I can wait till your birthday. Surprise? Yes. Uh, um, Princess. I don't, I, I don't understand. Whatever I am going to give you today, just know you deserve more than that. Huh? Um, you see this house, I... I just finished building it. Mm -hmm. last month mm -hmm. and I was waiting for the day of your birthday to hand over the keys and the documents to you as your birthday gift. Easy. Yes. No. Well, you know, as they say, <laughs> God works in a mysterious way. <laughs> Did you hear him? Udoka. Uh, yes. What are you saying? Are you saying that you're giving this house? You're giving this house to me? <laughs> Just on everything in it. Sir, you say this house is for her or for us?
I know you are happy. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. It's alright. How will I right. thank you? We talk. How will okay. I say thank you? Get back to your seat. Sorry, sir. You, you, right. you said the house is for her. Yes. Um, um sir. Sorry, please. I, I'm a bit confused. Huh? Did you say the house belongs to her? You heard me loud and clear. Well, this is not the time to joke now. Be serious. This is not the time for you to be funny. This house. Ha! Everything in it, including the car parked outside, belongs to you and your husband. Which car? This car? The, the car outside? <laughs> the that, white jeep outside. That car outside that I've been watching? Yes. Sir, hey, did you say the car hey, I've been watching? Okay, you, yes. you're giving us a house and a car. Exactly. <laughs> wait, before you rejoice, wait. Before you rejoice, oh wait, let me... Are you sure, sir? So wait, you don't want anything? Hey. No, nothing. Is it for free? You don't know what That's she did for me. Sir, because I, I know big <laughs> big men don't give things for free. No, no. Yeah? It's, it's, it's for free. You don't want anything? Nothing. I know I'm asking you. <laughs> There's nothing like that. She's a good, good woman. Hey. <laughs> Baby, how much did you give him? Hey! Eh? She's happy. <laughs> Thank you very much, sir. It's ah! alright. Thank you very much, sir. It's alright. It's alright. Thank you so much. Hey! Ah! No, no, no. I, I don't like this. I don't like. I don't like. Just get back to your seat. I don't like this. I don't. I don't. Just get back to your seat. Get back. Big house. I'll be leaving any time from now. Just let's finish with our drinks, okay? Goodness. Get back to your seat, princess. This is how to make the world a better place. Come and replenish your pocket. It's alright. Hey! It's alright. Hey! Thank you for what you did for me. Huh? It's God. It's alright. It's God. It's Sir. okay. <laughs> hey! One more thing, huh? Looking at your husband here. Your husband looks like a well-doing businessman. <laughs> I've been um, I will give your husband the sum of twenty million naira hmm, to start up something. Chimo, and twenty I, million. And I promise to take him uh, along with me to the hey. city where I do my business. You know, so I can give him connections. You know, connect him to men. That matters. Yeah. Men of timber and calibers. Men that have the power of transmission in their arms. Hey. Yeah? Hey. It's alright. It's okay. Uh, I know you're happy. Why say things? You are more than happy. Sir, excuse me, sir. Mm. You're doing all these things for free. For free. You're not, you don't want anything. Nothing. Are you sure? Absolutely this nothing. This is real. My husband <laughs> is real. It's real. My wife and I were happily married. Though. It's okay. You don't need anything. No, hey. no, nothing like that. Oh, <laughs> you're funny. You're. Oh, God, I 
said that and I lost. Stop now. Stop. What is all this crying competition for? Mama. What happened? Charles, my in law is dead. Is what, dead. What do you mean, Charles? Is dead. Daddy, mom! Oh. What happened? Die, no, no, what happened? Die! 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 The devil! Okay. <coughs> he was shot dead by the police in China. It's in the Facebook. Your sister saw it. I showed it to me. Hi! 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 No, no, no. It feels to me. Wait, it, it feels like a dream. Am I dreaming? Touch me, touch me, touch me. Touch me. I'm not touching you now. I'm touching you. It's real. Oh. Hey! Hey, whoa. Wait, 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 my lord. A few minutes ago, I was a gate man, right? Yes. Am I still a gate man? No. Honey, you are no more a gate man. You are now a dogu. A dogu? See, eh? we are going to employ a gate man. Hmm? Before you go and start opening and closing the gates, thinking that you are still a gate man, you are no more a gate man. Hey! hey! Honey, see how so, see how, see Baby, how, come, come, see come, 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 how come, 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 so. Hey! Honey, is it. So this guy is mine. Hey. Honey, see machine. Hey? See machine! See, just, just see. See the car. Hey! Wait, so are you going to drive this car to your father and your mother? No, can't finish me. No, sorry, sorry. No, are you trying to spoil my mood? Sorry. Please, I beg you the name of God. Don't even spoil my mood, though. Don't. Please, don't even mention their name I'm again. Sorry. I'm sorry. Don't mention their names. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Hi. God, thank you. Thank you, God. So this guy thank is Thank you. Out. Hey. God has blessed us so. God has blessed us, you doka. Oh, God has blessed us. Get up. Hey. Get up. What does this mean? God has blessed God, us. God, God, God has, has blessed you. God has finally answered that. God has, listen to me. God has blessed you because you are a good person. You have a good heart. You've been good to people. And that is why God has blessed you. Do you understand? God will bless you, Doka. God will prosper him. His business will continue to boom. But he, he's a rich man already. Stop praying. God will still bless him. Eh? Oh, you just, See, just nee, look at the car. I, I hope you will not come and. Come and what? You've started again. I just, you just, just, just let, me, let me go and look at the car. Eh? Hey! What is this? Our motto! Motto! Don't come! Hey! Did, did hey! Listen, hey! Listen, 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 what is this listen, motto I now? I, I hope. Oh! What is this support? Hey! What is the car now? You will not enter. Are you sure? You will not enter car. Eh? <laughs> Come out, come out, come out. Hey, let's do it. See our car now. What see our house. Is, hey? I hope all these things are for free. You started again. You started hey? again. You are just dulling me. Hey? I, I, I hope it's for free. Is it for free? It's for free now. Did you hear what he said? Inside? Wait now. Did you hear what he said? Wait, wait. Is it just for free? Just only to talk. It's for free. Free of charge. Mm. Mm. Free of charge. Mm -hmm. Wait. Free of charge. Free of charge. You will not come and say that he will. Tina, what is it again? 
Eh? Why are you uh, uh, sitting here crying? <laughs> it's okay. It's okay. Crying. It's okay, stop crying. You know? Ah! Mama, I'm finished too. I'm finished. My world has come to an end though. Where am I going to start? Mama. Mama, we're in trouble. Mama, we're in big trouble. Mama, in this whole house. We do not have more than 80,000 naira. Mama, that is all we have, oh man, abroad. How am I going to go? Chelsea, don't tell me he's not coming back. Who's good? Who's good? You see what I have been telling you? Eh? I told you when your husband was still alive. To collect money from him and start up a business, a solid business, like other women do. Yet you refused. You, you, you refused to listen to me. <laughs> How am yeah? I supposed to know? If you had listened oh. to me that time, you wouldn't have been sitting here now, crying for money. How am I supposed to know? Tell me okay. now. How am I supposed to know that my husband was going to die? But, but this is premature death. This is untimely death. This death is bad. This death is a very bad one. Charles is not supposed to die now. He's not supposed to die now. But my enemies ganged up. It's okay. It's okay. It's alright. I will tell you something. Oh, Charles. I will something. Chai. Charles. 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 Charles, no now. Charles, no now. You left me with only 80,000. No? 80,000. No? How am I going to use 80,000? Mama, we are finished. No? I'm not sure you know we are finished. I'm in trouble. It's okay. It's alright. Welcome to my house. Thank you, my dear. <laughs> hey! Please have a seat, have a seat, have a seat. Jesus. <laughs> Thank you, my dear. Hey! This house is so beautiful. I know. Thank hey. you. <laughs> oh, you've seen it now. God has blessed us. That is why I told you to come and see for yourself. My dear, when you were selling me this of food, I couldn't believe it. I know. I even told Clara. Uh, she couldn't believe it. Ah, Clara. I called her. And she doubted me. She thought I was lying. <laughs> God has blessed your friend. God has blessed me. <laughs> so, my dear, you need that to go to mm -hmm. telling me. Please, please, please. Yeah. For me. Yes, so. Beautiful. I need to dash you that guy outside. <laughs> hey! My friend, that is small. Though. That is not all. Do you know that he gave my husband the sum of 20 million naira? He gave him 20 million naira to start business. <laughs> God will bless that man. God will bless him. <laughs> okay, you've seen it. My life has changed. 
Oh, forgive my manners. Lineba, what do I offer you? Hmm? I can't wait to enjoy myself in this beautiful house. Abby! Yeah, no. <laughs> oh, yeah, now come. Let's go to the kitchen. Yes, I know. Hey! I hey. don't miss you. Let's go. <laughs> you said you wanted to see me. Yes, Mama. <clears throat> Mama, please sit. Mama, you are no longer a visitor to our present situation. You are a part of this family, so you know everything that is going on in this family. <sighs> Mama, you and I know that ever since my husband died, life has never remained the same. In fact, as I speak, Things are getting worse. Mama, we barely can even eat. My children are stuck at home. They can't go to school. <laughs> Simply because I cannot afford to pay their fees. And so many other things. How long are we going to continue like this, Mama? I definitely know that. I have to take the bull by the arm. I have to do something for this family so that at least we can we can move to the next chapter of our lives. So after this lamentation, what do you intend to do? <clears throat> Mama, it's very simple. We can always use what we have to get what we want. Mama, looking at everything. This mansion we live in. I mean, of what use is it? <laughs> We're living in a mansion. <laughs> we cannot eat. And my children can't go to school. Mama, it doesn't make any sense. I have decided to sell up this house. So that at least I can relocate us into a three bedroom apartment, a moderate three bedroom apartment, modest. And then I use the other part of the money to start up a business that can at least pay my children's fees, feed us, Mama, feed us, and then other things, support us to at least, Mama, just anything to start. So this business will help us and help our lives. And it will determine the next phase of our lives. Wait. I don't understand the word. You mean you want to sell this mansion? Use the money to move into three bedroom flat. That's what I said, Mama. Eh? Yes, Mama. Uh, no, 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 no. You know what? It will not work. So if you trouble, I regret that you never did. Mo wa Florence, eh? You regret that never did. You did not. But you regret that never did. You did Okay. So what do you want me to do, Mama? What do you want me to do? What are you bringing to the table? How are we going to move past this stage? Do you have better plans? Um, Izo. Excuse me, please come. You should even be here. I mean, you should be a part of this. Um, I was just having a conversation with mom. Okay. About our present condition. I mean, we're not strangers to ourselves. We all know what is going on in this family. We know our present situation. We're at a point where we cannot even feed. Oh. Mm. My kids cannot go to school because I cannot afford to pay fees. So, having thought of all this, I came up with a plan. And the plan is to sell up this house so that at least we can move into a modest, moderate three bedroom apartment, enough for our family size. Now, use the rest of the money to 
to start up a business that would in turn pay fees for my kids, feed us, mm. fund our lifestyle, mm. and I mean something we can start from there basically. That, that's the only way we can move to the next phase of life. Mm. So, uh, my, in my opinion, honestly, it's a uh, wickedness in high places. Another one. Oh. Yes. It's barely one year your husband died and you want to sell off his property? I don't understand. Hold on a minute. What is really going on here? I am making this sacrifice for the family. It is not for my selfish reasons. Then count me out of it. How do you mean count you out of it? I am trying to get us a roof over our heads and then send my children to school and feed us at the same time. Why are you making it look as if I want to sell up the house to, to buy clothes? Mama, you are in support of this? No, it's unbelievable. Like, I don't understand. If you want to sell this house, then it's none of my business. I'm out of it. Why are we holding on to the house? Why? No, tell me. Why? Tina, I, I'm not stopping you from selling this house. But I, I want to state my fact. I will not be part of it. Mama, you want to join her and sell this it house? It doesn't That's matter whether or not you are part of it. It is my house, my husband's house. Whatever I choose to do with it, it is my... Then go ahead and sell it then. What? Um, good day. Um, we are from General Merchant Bank. Yes? We are here to let you know that the loan of, of 140 million naira, the owner of this house, my name is Mr. Charles A.D.K., took from our bank, is long overdue for payment. And the papers we served him, it has expired. 140 million naira! And he used this house as a collateral. So we are giving him one week to come and pay up. Failure to do that, the bank will seize this property. Yes, and the one at number 7 Bank Road will sell it and cover our money. Please, slow down. Calm down because this is just a lot you're saying at the same time. I need to process this. If I heard you correctly, <laughs> you said my husband, Charles AGK, took a loan of 100 and what? 140 million naira. And you used this property and the one at number seven as collateral. Yes. And I I have just one week to produce how much again? One 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 fifty one hundred and fifty million. One million. hundred and forty million naira. Um my husband didn't tell me any of this. Well, we are sorry, madam. It's unfortunate that your husband didn't say about it. We're giving you one week to come and pay up. What? Wait, one week is too small. What are we going to do? I'm finished. For one week? Where are we going to get that kind of money? It's Mama, 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 Thank you, thank you. Yes, I remember you were telling me something about your mother and sister. Oh yes, Princess, a lot has happened. Mm. A whole lot. My sister Tina lost her husband. And um, my mother. May her soul rest in peace. Ever since then, things have been very rough for her. I mean, she has reduced to a total zero. I mean, sometimes I, I feel they deserve it. For the death of my mom, I feel pain somehow, but they mistreated you. I mean, the level of wickedness and heartlessness they meted on you, it's, it's undeserving. Undeserving, especially for someone as good-hearted as you are. So, um, after the level of um, 
wickedness and heartlessness the method on you to suit deserving of your person. Mm -hmm. I'm so sorry. Now look at you. God has blessed you tremendously. I mean, look at the car we were drove in here with. That's something else. Good people always reap good rewards. You deserve everything you have right now. It's okay, Zuno. I honestly don't want to remember what Tina did to me. But you're a nice person. And I know what you can do. So because of that, I would ask my husband to do something for you. You're serious? Yes. You put in words to your husband for me? Mm -hmm. Wow! So grateful. Thank you. Thank you so much. That's all right. Thank you. Right. So, tell me what do I have for you? Nothing. No. I think I'm fine. No, I don't want you. I'll be right back. <laughs> <laughs> Princess. Princess. Princess, it's me. Oh. I'll just get I'll just go get the the garden eggs and granites. Be careful how you treat us that's so on your dinner girl Meti Bayama On your dinner girl Metu one day mano one a men to worry Be me na heartless not taking anywhere in life no condition is permanent here in this world. No condition is permanent. No again in wickedness. We can't do No condition is permanent here. Princess. 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 No condition is permanent here in this world. A pamadu puchi pega yali pega no. Again in wickedness, we can to people. No condition is permanent here in this world. I called you both because there is something I want to tell you. But I will start from you, Izuna. You remember the last time you were here? Okay, I yes. told you I was going to tell my husband to do something for you. Mm -hmm. So I have done that. So my husband said I should give you five million naira to start with. What? So please use the money wisely. I'll make a transfer of five million naira to you. <laughs> Courtesy of my husband. Five million? It's okay, Zuna. It's okay. <laughs> oh, thank you. Thank you. Thank you, my princess. You're welcome. God bless him. Amen. 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 <laughs> Tessie, my good friend, is the boy him? I know what I'm about to tell you will surprise you because, I mean, you'll be wondering, I still remember. <laughs> You remember when you told me that um, school business gives money? Yes, I remember. I told you that. Mm -hmm. And if you have money, you would want to build a school, even if it's a one-room apartment. Mm -hmm. And within a short time, you're going to make it. Mm -hmm. You remember? Yes. Okay. So I spoke to my husband, and he told me to tell you to look for a land 
and that he will pay for the land. Zuna. And once he pays for the land, he will also build you a school. A good school. Oh my God. And also get you a school bus. Me? Mm -hmm. Yeah. School owner. Wait, that's not all. I'm also going to transfer you the sum of 3 million naira. What? 3 million naira? For your upkeep. My I want you to use it to take good care of yourself. Buy things. Do whatever you want with it. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Because we have really suffered. So you need to enjoy yourself. Okay? My princess, <laughs> God will bless you. God will bless you. Yeah. In fact, Amen. no need of looking for a plot of land. Mm -hmm. Yes. My father has a very big land in a good site. So what are we talking Five about? Five plots of land. Wow. Princess, where do you draw your strength from? Hey. I mean, you're so nice. And I will always be. <laughs> you both were there for me when I needed someone. Isn't it? Thank you so Thank much. Thank you so much. Thank you. Oh. Isu. Isu, where, where are you? Where are you going with your bag? I'm, um, I'm going back to Abuja. You said you wanted to see me, so I waited for long. You were nowhere to be found. So I decided to get going. I, I went to buy my fruits to sell. Oh, okay. Um, Izu. Yes. Izu, you, you said you were going to see the princess yesterday. Did you, did you see her? If I saw the princess. Why are you suddenly interested in seeing the princess? Yes, I saw her. What the fuck? Um, I was I was going to I was going to ask you to take me to the princess. I want to apologize to her for everything that I did wrong. I know she doesn't deserve it. She doesn't deserve to be treated that way. I am a bad person. It's because I've not experienced wealth before. So the wealth came and I lost control. I never knew wealth could make me behave that way. I'm sorry, I apologize. The princess was an amazing person to me. She sacrificed a lot. She gave, she, she did a lot for me and my family. She didn't deserve to be treated that way. I just want to say sorry to her, please. I warned you. I warned you, but you refused. You shunned every advice I ever gave to you. Because you allowed this wealth and materialistic things get into your head so much that you forget about common humanity. You treated the princess so bad. I was warning. Look, it will be disastrous if I disclose the princess's location to you. She doesn't want to see you. She doesn't want to set eyes on you. Ever. So, I won't betray her that way. Izu. Yes. Izu, you are my brother. Izu, I'm your sister. Izu, blood is thicker than water. Please, I know the princess. I know your... The two of you are in a very good place. You have a good relationship going on. Mm. And I believe that if you talk to her for me, she will listen to you. She respects you. I also know that she's a good person at heart. Mm -hmm. Please, I beg you, just take me to her. I just want to say sorry. Are you That's done? all. Are you done? Eh? Okay. My dear sister, I'm so sorry for whatever you're going through right now. Okay? But I can't betray the princess because I'm not you. Hmm? The princess loved you so much. She cared for you like her own. She took care of you. She took care of the entire family. Who would do that? Look, right now, 
the princess gave me five million naira to set up a business and that's why i'm all packed and going back to abuja so i'm going to go back to abuja get a place perhaps to stay and sort out my friends rent or whatever then settle myself there remember i told you and mama that karma doesn't need your address remember that statement yeah i told you tina don't get me all worked up with emotions please I have, Tina, I need to leave. I'm so happy for you. Congratulations. I'm happy for you. It's if you win, I win. Congrats. God bless the princess. Please. I have to leave. Is you? I'll call the princess and see what I can do. Is you? Is you be cool now? Be cool. Please. Izu. 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 Izu na. Izu. Izu. Your Majesty, I cannot take you to where the princess is. I, I really cannot take you. <laughs> I'll take you there. No, 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 no. She doesn't even want to see the both of you at all. Like she doesn't want to see you. Why? Hold on. Just take us to where our daughter is. We will apologize. She's still our daughter. She will forgive us. Please. I know why my daughter is angry with me. Oh. Okay? But I'm prepared to make amends. Directly I see the husband. Um, I'll give him money. But I'll give him enough money to start. <laughs> What's funny about this? <laughs> wait, wait. With your, the princess, you give the princess and her husband money yes. to start a business? Yes. Are you kidding me? Oh no. Um, the princess is far richer. You see, if the budget of this country, if anybody can afford the budget of this country, I think it's the princess right now. She's that rich. And she has business connections everywhere. Round the globe. Listen, forget about money, dashing money, or whatever. Just take us to where our daughter is. I want to see my daughter. Please. Your Majesty, my queen, the princess is super rich. That if the royal household has 10% of wealth, the princess commands 120 percent yes they gave me five million naira just for visiting like you know visit uh, izuna take this one just go five million check and look at me now and then whoever greets them my princess she signs a check five million two million if you vex with them if you're angry with them, they give you money, they dash you money. I can even take the both of you there so that they can dash you your own money. Yes, I mean, look at the palace. We need money here, don't we? Oh, yes. Are you joking with me right now? No, 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 sorry, not a joke. Sorry, hello? Yes. No, pay in the 10 million, I will be in the office right now. Yes, yes, I, I am coming right now. Okay, 
Yes, 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 yes. <laughs> uh, and Chuma, Uncle. look at you. You are looking so handsome. Uh huh. Uncle, was I not handsome before? Hey, you handsome before, but this one man, there's a big difference. You <laughs> <laughs> even your head. It's a big am it's a little My daughter. I don't want to. I'm happy for you. I'm happy for you. Thank you. And I'm also uh, uh, thanking that uh, God sent uh, by name Udoka that made you this rich. At least your father will not know that no condition is permanent. Mm -hmm. And the mother can stay fall from heaven. Right. Look at both of you. Hi. Uncle, I'm happy. thank you so much, Uncle. We're here, we're here to to show appreciation for everything you've done for us. Hey. We talk about you every day. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Uncle, you stood by us, you helped us, you supported us, and we're here to say thank you. I appreciate you with this little drink. Yeah. Yes. Yes. Check me. There's more there. Wait, 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 wait. Sir? Chuma. Sir? I am seeing something here. <laughs> I am seeing something here. You know, so there's a car. It's a forever. No, no, no. It came with it. Moon. Yes. Sir, that, that's a million naira, please. Just uh, hold Hey! On. Yeah. Hey! <laughs> you deserve this. Ah! Ah! Uncle, you deserve this. One million naira. Yes, Uncle. Hey, because I don't want to get that appointment, young guy. Mama, 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 mama. I get tired of my cabai. Chuma, Uncle. If you know, I will paint it. Now there is money. I will paint it. And I'm sure this money you give, you, you just give me now. But this time this year, you will buy me a car. Obviously. Oh, obviously. I will paint this out. Which color? Which color? Which color? Which color? Which color? <laughs> Help me. What, which color? Hey, I will paint it the color of this your car. Hey! Hey! Oh, okay. Thank you very much. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. You can't buy a dog. You can't buy a dog. Thank you very much. Okay. Majesty, I, I told her she said she doesn't want to see you as a queen. I beg your pardon. You mean my daughter said that? Yes, my queen. Ah. Now wait a minute. Did you tell her that it's her father who wants to see her? I told her, Your Majesty. As a matter of fact, she instructed the gate now not to allow both of you inside. What about the husband, my son-in-law? Oh, he traveled to China. China? What did you say? My God. Tai what? Yes, he actually travels to different parts of the world, in different countries. Oh, he travels to China. Let's go. Hmm? Okay. Go away! Your Majesty! Are they not possible? Now that I'm here, I must surely see my daughter. Hey! Young man! Take a look at my face very well. She looks like me. I know. So I want you to go in there. Tell her that I'm here. And I want to see her. I'm sorry, ma'am. I'm sorry, sir. You can't go in. I beg your pardon. See, go in there, bring out a bed for her. Even you? My queen, I'm sorry. She can see. Even you?
What are you doing here? What are you doing in my house? My daughter. My in-law, please, you have every right to be angry because we offended you in so many ways. You even have the right to throw us away. But please, show mercy. I'm sorry. And in there, Mommy's best friend, my joy, my jewel, my all and all. Did you think I would survive without you? It's not possible. Sorry, please. <laughs> Princess. Pr Princess, I am sorry. I am so sorry for everything that I've done to you. Please find a place in your heart to forgive me. I am not proud of what I've done. But I know that deep down, you are a good person. Please. Please. I beg of you. Please find a place in your heart to forgive me. I am so sorry. Sorry.